Hold it up. Are you leaving? Oh, yeah, we live. Let me get out my phone so I can see this chat. Yo, let me know if y'all can hear me. Mika, what's good? My nigga Bugs, what's happening, G? I'm not nice, what's good? Let me know if y'all can hear me, though. This motherfucker was moving slow. I don't know what the fuck was going on. Can y'all hear me? Let me know. Let me know. Guess I can hear me. Can y'all hear me? Somebody let me know if y'all can hear me. Because I feel like y'all can't. Oh, there we go. Oh. <laughs> my, my phone was bullshit. And it, uh, it wasn't loading the, uh, the comments for some reason. All right, we good now. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. What's going on, y'all? What's good? Salute to everybody in the we chat. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Don't play another song. Slow your roll. It's going all right, Cold Pepsi. It's going all right. I just got to, uh, just got to say a few things. 
because motherfuckers just be asking for it. So, as you see by the title, uh, I gotta address King Goofy Ass JJ. Cause he feeling some type of way for whatever reason, but we gonna get into it. So basically, he did a lot earlier today. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I guess he called himself calling out everybody. Oh, you seen him call Pepsi? You seen the little post? Yeah. So, niggas be in the bushes, you know what I'm saying? All up in the bushes, taking screenshots and shit. And I guess that's their receipts and all this shit. Like, bro, like, I don't know what you're talking about. So, I was in the chat whenever the fuck it was. And, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I guess he mad because uh, Myron called... Uh, faith predator and uh i made a joke about it because they be calling me predator too <laughs> so i made a joke about it <laughs> first off let me uh let, let me let me put this out there uh so silly i mean i don't even know why i call her silly uh monica mo justice was in the chat you know what i'm saying in my chat and uh I saw her in the chat. I was like, I was like, shit, they call me silly too. I was like, hey mama. I was like, they call me silly. Uh no, I was like, they call me, uh, they call me silly son. Hey mama. I was I was saying that towards uh towards Monica Mo Justice. And then Myron said something about Faith looking like Predator. I was like, damn. They call me Predator too. And I, I think I put some laughing emojis or some shit. <laughs> So the nigga got mad. Like, bruh, what the hell wrong with you, bruh? So, <laughs> bruh, real talk, you barking up the wrong tree, bruh. I don't know uh, what the hell wrong with you. You be in them bushes all in your feelings or, or what, bruh. But uh, that that ain't got shit to do with me. So I'm going to basically just uh, play his live and uh, I'm going to put my little commentary on let me know if y'all can hear the the, uh, the live kind of good. I ain't gonna make no digs, I ain't got nothing else to say. Yeah, man, because they were real, bro. About Mr. Light and Stripe, I need all the information on JJ Ice Fish and Gears. Don't the fuck you said, bro. Well, I'm saying, I know what you said there, bro. And I saw him the shit. Nick. Still need to come in soon. So I'm waiting on him to bring his ass all through, too. Know you in the motherfucker home? All right, thank you, Lisa. Exactly. Because they don't want to pass. I got a figure out group with you. I need my motherfucking wife, bro. So fuck the dumb shit, fool. And I ain't never need nothing to you, bro. Me or bro. You didn't have to type that in, bro. You don't have to type shit in to be cool with these motherfuckers. Hold on, hold on. I'm in your chat and why you uh, address that dish. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, that dish this is I did nothing to you fuck your face. <laughs> Bruh, I thought you was talking about me the whole time. Red Bull, get the fuck out of here, dog. Damn. God damn. Your ass down somewhere. <laughs> What's good, Tiff and Tat? <laughs> yeah, <man. laughs> Yo, this. <laughs> right. None in the chat. You fucking. She fucking on my floor. Hold up, real quick.
All right, I'm back. My bad, y'all. All right, continue. So basically, the the first time he was uh mentioning that shit, he was basically mentioning he was he was talking about straight drop and how he was trying to find out information on him and he was trying to find out information on me and shit. <clears throat> blah blah blah. If you read your life, my nigga, you understand me, your man. Hold on, let me run this back. Exactly. Complete whatever. These ass all through too. I know you in the motherfucking room. Complete whatever. Yeah, I was in there. Exactly, because they don't want to pass. I got to figure out who you. I need my motherfucking wife, bro. So fuck the dumb shit, fool. And I ain't double getting nothing to you, bro. Me or bro. You didn't have to type that in, bro. You don't have to type shit in to be cool with these motherfuckers, bro. If you real life, my nigga, you understand me, your man? I'm saying this shit. Girls, another thing I want to everybody want to go back, man, and constantly reach it back. This your words for you. All right, so basically, bro, this nigga talking about I shouldn't have typed that in the chat, bro. Bro, you don't control what I type in the chat, bro. Like, if if some shit, first of all, bro, I ain't make no joke towards your your wife. I don't care if Myron just called your your wife predator or not, bro. At the end of the day, nigga, do your wife look like predator? Do she? Are you hurt by that? Like damn, nigga. <laughs> and like I said, nigga, I made a joke because they called me predator too, so I made a joke. Is is that okay? I guess not. <laughs> but like I told him, like I told him, no, nah, y'all gonna hear. I'm gonna just continue. You reaching your ass back too, nigga. For the last time, I'm sure. I want so to. now, so now he trying to. Everybody want to go back, mine and constantly. Y'all hear what this nigga just said? Y'all hear what this nigga just said? So, when the last time I made a video on World? That'd be today. <laughs> That'd be today. Did I mention anything about uh uh World News uh sexual preference? Did I mention anything about that? I mean, even if I did, nigga, it's shit you didn't say. Nigga, you said it already. But oh, but now you so buddy buddy with world news that you know what I'm saying. <laughs> anything that that you said before now is 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 null and void. Now you and your feelings. Anytime your brother world get brought up. <laughs> hey, mug shot, I feel you. But it gotta be said. It gotta be said. Cause niggas, I don't know. Niggas think they be running some shit out here. Niggas think they be running some shit out here. Like dog. <laughs> I don't know who you thought I was, bro. I don't know if you thought I was world news from 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 three months ago. I don't know if you thought that's who I was. <laughs> I don't know if if that's who you thought I was, but nah, that's not the case. I'm not world news from three months ago, my nigga. Remember. All right, now everything was now everything was jokes. Everything was jokes. When did it become jokes? A month ago. A month ago, it became jokes. Okay. And I've been saying that years. Years. Good thing like mine. A lot of you motherfuckers be on your mind. And take out y'all want to take your mind. Coward ass niggas, man. Y'all be wanting to say this shit, man. The same shit. I got the nuts to say. Word. Got the nuts, nuts, nuts to say. Rickers got the nuts to say. I can fucking balls nuts to say down on you bitches, man. We say the shit. 
y'all don't think of it, but y'all some hoes. Y'all don't see us the information, bro. Yeah, I don't know who you talking about right now. So we can say this shit for y'all, bitch ass, bro. Fuck now, that's why we don't use this shit. Bro. He, he ain't talking about me right now. I don't know what he talking about. <laughs> and it's fucked up, bro. That's on some real cow ass shit, bro. All right, this 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 one I popped up in the chat. I popped up in the chat. Like I said, I was at work. I couldn't uh hop in right away. You know what I'm saying? But I did hear my name a couple times. Like I said, I wasn't even listening, really listening that hard. You know what I'm saying? Until I heard my name get mentioned. So when I finally was able to type in the chat, I'm like, "What, nigga?" <laughs> Y'all worry about everything with the. Exactly, K. Exactly, K. Like I said, this nigga been he been hiding in the chats, hiding in the chats, taking screenshots and shit. Now he on there. Oh, I got receipts. I got receipts, bro. What do you think? What do you think? I'm a I'm a run from what I said, bro. I yeah, I said that shit, nigga. If you took offense to me making a joke about myself, nigga, nigga, you gonna have to get on with that shit, nigga. I'm getting. I don't. I really don't care, bro. But the rest. But where did this shit lead to? The fuck you need to be worried about, man. Your own motherfucking home, bro. Byron. Motherfucker been on their homes, bro. The fuck wrong with you, nigga? Don't nobody don't sleep no. Nobody over here, bro. Don't don't pay. All right, what nigga? What I was saying, bro. What's you good, come bring bringing up shit I said about world, bro. What the fuck did King do to you while you over there in peace meeting them champ, bro? He never ain't on that bullshit. Like this sneak ass predator comment that you said. The way you said it, bro, was in a joking form, bro. But marriage just got through calling my motherfucking wife, bro, the predator, bro. What the fuck we do to you, nigga? Y'all hear this, nigga? Y'all hear it. Now, then I just get done telling y'all. <laughs> the joke was basically at myself. But since, since Myron just said something about predator and his wife <laughs> the nigga and his feelings it's all the one to know girls because if it's what i'm thinking is what i'm for bro yo 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 homie that fuck you fuck with you burn and told you this shit i'm exposed this bitch ahead bro okay i feel you bro but you ain't got a mind be on that fuck shit so if you on that fuck shit let me know then bro all right so my response, nigga, I, I told him I'll be in any chat I want to be in. I said, I'll be in any chat I want to be in. P. Smith, what's good? Much love to you. Yeah, you already know we in the building. This clown ass nigga, man. <laughs> I told this nigga, I'll be in any chat I want to be in. Straight up. Fuck with you, Brian. He told you this shit. I'm exposed this bitch ahead, bro. And yo, I don't yo, even. Yo, I don't even know what he said. If who told me what, I don't know what he talking about. Uh, right there, I don't know who he said. He said, "I'm exposed." This, um, yeah, yeah, this shit get real. Nigga get, nigga get real disrespectful. Not even just towards me. You feel me? I'm in that fuck you, fuck with you, burn and told you this shit. I'm exposed. This bitch ahead, bro. Okay, I feel you, bro. But you ain't got a mind. Be on that fuck shit. So if you on that fuck shit, let me know then, bro. Let, let me explain some some how, how this shit is is some clown shit so this nigga this nigga can joke all day on p smith right he can call he can call p smith all type of bitches he can call her anything he want to he can uh he can joke about her wig all day right now if i was over there laughing at they shit they'd be cool with it if i was over there laughing at they shit they'd be cool with it but since since I made a joke towards myself, now, now you and your feelings. That's some clown shit right there. That's some clown shit. If I was over there condoning his shit, it would have been cool. And I know I, I want to see your answer, bro. And my next answer, I'm basically going to tell you. You're about a check. But the title got me and my, my, my wife a name on. So that means you don't fuck with me and my wife, then you roll it with that takeover shit, right? That's all I want to know, bro. I wait. When I said they called me predator. Now, bro, I wait. And my wife, then you roll it with that takeover shit, right? But the title got me and my, my, my wife a name on. So that means you don't fuck with me and my wife, then you roll it with that takeover shit, right? <laughs> hey, everybody know I've been saying takeover, right? Everybody know that, right? 
and he been said fuck everybody in the takeover movement right not saying that i took offense to that but he that's what he been said and and knowing that he be in the bushes he already know so like i said this nigga just been he been waiting he been waiting he said so you don't fuck with me and my wife right if i ain't fuck with you and your wife I mean, whether or not I fuck with you and your wife or not, if I ain't disrespecting y'all, what's the problem? Whether I fuck with y'all or not, if I ain't disrespecting y'all, what's the problem? Oh, see, the problem, like I said, the problem was niggas expecting me to be over there condoning his shit. This all I want to know, bro. I'll wait. Never for when I said they called me predator. Nah, no, bro. Nah, no, now you ain't finna try, you ain't finna do that to me, man. When Mary said my wife looked like the predator, bro, that's when you said that shit, bro. It's good, Queen. You got what I'm saying, bro. Jokes is jokes. All right, then. I told him, I told him, jokes is jokes. Because, nigga, if you get mad, and nigga, if you that mad over your wife getting called predator, or me dropping a comment after your wife got called predator. Nigga, you got some bigger issues to deal with. You feel me? This what's up. Okay. I got a joke for your ass then, man. <laughs> nah, you mad. Okay. I, thought, I told him straight up, bro. Jokes joke is joke. your ass then, man. Okay. All right. So you, 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 ready? you, so you ready for this, bro? Is Peace Nipper going to save your ass, bro? And am I supposed to be intimidated? And, and you already know P. Smith got my bail money. Stop playing. <laughs> Stop playing. That's all I want to know, bro. Because all I got to do, bro, is to do a special live, bro. A special live? What, what you going to do? What you going to bring out on me, bro? JJ, what is you going to bring out on me? Huh? I'm telling you, bro. You barking up the wrong tree, bro. His shit was fucking up, but if you ain't here, he said you and Jahira, bro. But we gonna continue. No thanks, bro. And come on, girls, the top is short nigga on your ass, bro. And girl, I don't know shit about world, bro. Next. Nigga, ha have I been asking you about shit about world? Bruh. Listen, have I been asking you for anything, any information about world news, bro? Ain't you the one who, who came out and did live after live on world news? Forgot, bro. Y'all y'all be forgetting a lot of shit. A lot of shit. I don't have to come to you for shit, nigga. You put it all out there. Why y'all mad, bro? Cause I forgave him, bro. And move the fuck on like you need to do, bro. Nigga, listen. Nigga, I ain't mad about you for shit, bro. That's the thing. That's the thing. You can do what you want, bro. But over here, niggas never fold. That's what it is, nigga. Never fold. So when you keep talking about you ain't call me back, nigga, we ain't got shit to talk about. Straight up. Did I start dissing you, nigga? No. But like I said, nigga never followed. Nigga, we ain't had shit to talk about. Is that what you mad about, bro? I never called you back? That's what you mad about? Bro. Motherfucking thing, nigga. Thought you was 100, bro. You got my personal motherfucking number, bro, but you never used no girl. Did you catch that? Did you catch that? What's good, Fred? What's good, uh, Planet of Psyops? I don't know if, uh... <laughs> You still go by that, but 
that's what I remember you as. I don't want to call you. I'm deleting my channel and shit. <laughs> What's good, K? <Kay? laughs> Yo, they wilding. <laughs> but like he said, he gave me his personal number and I never used it. But to be real, I meant to text you after we got off the phone that last time. You know what I'm saying? I meant to text it to you. But I forgot. But you know what? Nigga, I'm glad I forgot. I'm glad I forgot. Nigga, I don't want you blowing up my motherfucking phone every damn day, calling me back to back and shit. Nigga, I'm glad I ain't give you my real fucking number, nigga. That was a blessing, nigga. Already was blowing the hangouts up, nigga. I'm glad I gave you my real number. First, hey, keep it 100, nigga. Well, you done jumped out here, you won't laugh at it. Don't do it to y'all camp, camp girls. I promise you, bro. When I expose y'all leader, bro, it's gonna fuck y'all up, bro. So don't do it to yourself, you and your heart. Stay the fuck out the comments. This nigga just told me stay out the comment section. <laughs> yo <laughs> yo hey i'm gonna call you that that's pre <laughs> we gonna call you predator <laughs> shout out my max fit real talk <laughs> yo they want <laughs> let me run this back a little bit you won't laugh man I'm up for the Don't do it to y'all camp, camp girls. I promise you, bro. When I expose y'all leader, bro, it's gonna fuck y'all up, bro. Wait, MC, MC. Hey, I'm sitting there. I'm sitting there thinking, like, who the fuck is our leader, folks? Who is my leader? Like, damn, who is our camp leader? I don't know who it is. I'm thinking, I ain't even exposed the leader. Who <laughs> exposed the leader? Real talk. This nigga was on some shit this morning, y'all. <laughs> hey, I better stay the fuck. Hey, bam, I'm telling you. He said, that's a promise, not a threat, nigga. You better stay the fuck up out them comment sections, nigga. He said, South Memphis, ho. <laughs> yo, this nigga crazy, yo. Niggas, niggas about to expose the leader. And I got to stay out the comment sections. Whoa. <laughs> So don't do it to yourself, you and Jahara. You and Jahara. Stay the fuck out them comments. And that's it, that's being real, bro. So you saying, like, fuck me and my wife, nigga. So it's fuck y'all, bro. You and that Jahara, bitch. Listen, bro. I don't know why the fuck you calling Jahara out her name, bro. But, uh, yeah, bro, you keep exposing yourself, bro. Uh. Shout out to Mar Maxfield for uh coming up with the phrase uh microwave Christian. Cause niggas be some microwave Christians out here. Just to be real. <laughs> Just to be real. And I got jokes, bro. Fuck you mean, bro. Hold on. L listen, listen to this joke. Listen to this joke. You might you might see it coming. I'm just be real. And I got jokes, bro. Fuck you mean, bro. You whoopie gold bird looking motherfucker. Now how about that, girls? Since you laughing at me and my wife. Now, nigga. You hear this? How about that? How about that? Now how about that? Come on now, bro. What's good, Cherry? How you doing? Now drop all the lies you want to drop, bro. Girls. Oh, what, right, man? Girls. Bitch ass, nigga. What's wrong with you, young man? For real, nigga. Hey, hold up, hold up, hold up. So, I, I, I'm the bitch ass nigga, right? JJ, JJ. So I, I'm the bitch ass nigga. But but you the one who uh, you out here dick riding the nigga who said uh, the nigga who who told you that your wife wanted to fuck him, right? Called your wife all type of bitches. 
all type of shit, right? But now you out here dick riding them. Now every everything you said was jokes. Now nah, that's your brother, but I'm the bitch ass nigga. I'm the bitch ass nigga. Okay, you you out here defending this nigga name more than he is. But I'm the bitch ass nigga. Okay. Now you gonna make me expose your motherfucking fearless lead over there? Hold on, y'all. I think we're getting closer to this exposure, y'all. Hold on. I think we might. I think we might find out who our leader is, y'all. Yeah. Fuck you, mean. Keep on, girls. The whole camp gonna be laughing at y'all. Girls. Keep on, girls. Keep on, girls. Fuck you, mean. Keep on, girls. The whole camp gonna be laughing at your whole ass, bro. For real, fool. Cause if your little motherfucking scam in a joke, bro, everybody else over there is, nigga. And the nigga already told me who the fuck they was. And them no facts, nigga. Huh? Told you bitches, man. Y'all been playing with me, already, bro. And go ahead, go there, go to your little bit ass Uber car, bro. And do a fucked up ass lab, bro. And end your motherfucking YouTube career, weak ass nigga. <laughs> he said my Uber car. He said my Uber car. Oh damn. Fuck you mean, bro. Speaking upon another man being is like that, bro. That's a real whole shit, bro. Fuck you mean. Today, today, the reason why I fuck with you, JJ, is because my ain't she trying to hold us. You don't give a fuck. Girls. Girls. Hey. Ryan, nigga, cold, nigga, shit, my big ass, nigga. Fuck wrong with you? Fuck. Laughing at me and my motherfucking white like this shit. Fun this on mine. Bro, this nigga real life down there finna cry, bro. <laughs> Fuck wrong with you, bro? <laughs> Laughing at my motherfucking wife like that, bro. Bro, first of all, nigga, uh, uh, much love to uh society, but listen, I'm not society, folks. I'm not gonna be on there talking about, oh, I'm, I'm not gonna laugh at your uh wife and that, that, and that, motherfucker. If it's a joke and that shit funny, I'm, I'm gonna laugh at it, nigga. You gonna have to get over that shit, nigga. Yeah, Myron, I guess so, man. You finna end this motherfucker. Goddamn. For real, for you work and keep talking. Yeah, bro. By the time you get home, I've been exposed bugs ass, bro. Oh, oh. The leader has been unmasked. <laughs> Hold up. Did you catch that? Let me run it. Yeah, bro. By the time you get home, I've been exposed bugs ass, bro. Then your bitch ass ain't gonna be back on here, bro. By the time you get home, I've been exposed bugs ass, bro. Then your bitch ass ain't gonna be back on here, bro. By the time you get home, I've been exposed bugs ass, bro. Then your bitch ass ain't gonna be back on here, bro. Man, you want your home, motherfucker. Motherfucker. Now go and call and ask him about that, bitch ass nigga. Y'all hear this goofy shit? Yeah, we got all the screenshot, bro. And guess what? Shit recording, nigga. So ask him to lie about this shit, bro. Fuck you mean, girl. I tried to spare you, bro. Choke ass nigga. Yeah. Shout out to my nigga Bugs. The the leader out here, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Can can we get the hold on? We need the motherfucking beam on this motherfucker. We gotta put the beam on this motherfucker straight up. Hold up. Oh, ask him where that money at they post got. From people in boot in, in Bug's name. In Bug's name. Oh, 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 oh. Hold, hold on. Did I read this right? Ask him where that money at they supposed to got from people in Bug's name. Oh, okay. Hold on. Let me see. Uh this is my first time doing this shit. Let me see if I how the fuck I do this shit. How the fuck I add somebody to the call? Okay, here we go. Uh, oh, that was easier than I thought. You know what I'm saying? I just sent that motherfucker now. Oh, we got to put the beam. Hey, Myron, Myron, we got to put the beam on these niggas, man. Hold up.
<laughs> Yo, oh, the leader is here. Hey, oh, the, hey, the leader in the building, man. Everybody the leader in the fucking out. building. Everybody bow down real quick. Hey, get on one knee. And, and hey, hey. Knee. Oh, yeah. now, 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 Gibbs, didn't I tell you a couple months ago that it was coming to this? Man, hey, you. I spoke with you, Jahar, and Boss Lady about them, right? Facts, real talk. Now, I can do it however he want to do it with his receipts, cause you know I, you know I got screenshots. Uh, you know they was begging to uh how you got money from people and collected damn near what they said close to eight hundred dollars from mm -hmm. people, and those Ooh. people gave supposed to gave y'all that for books. And then, uh, what y'all end up sending me? And after I, after I spoke with y'all, and I got screenshots so of y'all, we know you ain't asked for nothing, books. We know you won't ask nobody for nothing. All that, and you know, she did the live on Huggy page. Uh, you know, went out her way to make it seem like the day was exclusively talking to me. Mm -hmm. uh, and. You know, even when it's fires to show the box that I got from the hospital. And at the time, you know, and like I told y'all, I ain't want nobody to think the bugs do no well and about nothing that was going on with me. So I said, boom, since people, you know, people was questioning it. The same people that all of a sudden you so cool with, you know what I mean, was questioning the situation or whatever. So I said, boom. I went to the hospital expecting my child. This is what I left with. You put it on huggy shit, whatever. Cool. You on the phone conversation. We collected damn near eight hundred dollars for you and your family. Whenever you ready, books, let us know. Never ask them for nothing. So I hit them, and I got screenshots. So play your. Play the game if you want to, JJ, and y'all get exposed for the fraud shit that y'all did. Uh, so, you know, when I spoke upon the money, uh, when I was like, well, you know, I hit them like, if people gave y'all money for me, you know what I mean, I can use this shit, right? So, because, like I say, from the jump, it was people gave us money for you. We collected money for you, books. And your family, you didn't ask us. So when I said, well, um, look, you say somebody gave you money for me. So I'm already wondering if somebody gave you money to me, then why are you waiting on me to call you? If somebody gave you something for me, then it should have been sent to books. Right or wrong? Facts. It should have been sent ASAP. So. Oh, fuck if you wanted it or not. Send that shit. So, man, you. Man, man, you said something about uh, I got to get an okay from everybody. So I'm assuming that nobody sent you their money unless it's already okay. Right? Right. Exactly. Okay. So I'm like, okay. So I get a text later on. Never spoke to my, my lady. Never asked to speak to her. So all of a sudden when I mention the money, it's like, you know, it's like a little attitude, you know, a little hostility came. Because I mentioned, you know, because it was, like I said, always, we waiting on you, boobs, just sitting right here. I said something about the money. It was hostility all of a sudden. Then it was, can I speak to your wife? And I go into detail how disrespectful Faith was when she got on the phone with my lady. The first thing she said. And then, in the mix of me trying to grieve because we just lost my son. Y'all was still messaging me, calling me. I won't answer the phone to tell me what DC, World News, Straight Drop, and Logic was saying. Now, why would you call me when I'm grieving over losing my child a week before my child was supposed to be born? You calling me, telling me what they saying on the internet. Like, who, like, bro, who does that? Exactly. Who, who the hell is worried about that? Bro, you never wanted to help. The only reason y'all came around was because that y'all for two, almost two years been trying to attack straight drop and couldn't get them out the way. And y'all tried to jump on the wave. The only reason that y'all wanted to help, just like y'all did World News, was so later on, you can come up here and talk shit about the person. 
And mind you, I told you you're supposed to collect it eight hundred dollars in Boog's name because of my situation. I didn't ask you to, and you sent a hundred, a hundred and some dollars, and you came up with something about at the last minute it was another family that was in need. So I was like, oh, well, I ain't tripping. I'm blessed with whatever. People know how I am. I'm grateful for, you know, whatever somebody do. Now, where's your receipts? Where's your receipts for the for the for the rest of the money that you collected from people that you gave to somebody else all of a sudden? Right. All it's of a coincidence sudden. that when I say something about the money that people gave you for me, that you went around and you and you blasted my business. And what me and my family was going through for content, you did to try to right. paint the picture that you were some type of you and your husband was some type of uh people that care about people and look out for people to try to paint that narrative like you had bugs back when you just wanted to talk about it. You got messages, I got messages. It's your side of the story, mine and mine line up with the truth. Where's the rest of the money then? Since you want to talk about exposing something, what you going to expose that I called you? Did I te did I message you after you was blowing my shit up? And I said, well, look, if the people gave you money for me, because I was already wondering why I didn't get it if they gave it in my name. Really? Second of all, when Faith said what she said and the shit was totally out of line, when she got on the phone without even saying how you doing or uh, sorry for your loss, uh JJ, I straightened her. Then you try to get on the phone. He couldn't even, he was choking up, fumbling his words. She had to get the phone back to say the conversation. So you can talk all the gangster shit. The the hoorah, the yelling, the hoorah, and all that, bro. You stunned. Who you gonna expose, bro? Who you you gonna expose the fact that you collected money or you lied about that, or you or you kept the money that you collected in my name. It's either one of the two. You you lied about what you collected, then you kept trying to put reckless and huggy in it about what they supposed to do. When I had spoke with Huggy, and it was not the conversation was nothing about him doing anything because I never asked any of y'all to do nothing. Jahara, Gills, when I went through that, they hollered at me. Asked them. I spoke to them the night this happened. Cause I knew, cause I knew that this would happen. I knew that JJ would be a clown like he is. A peon, his his wife got his nuts in her purse, <laughs> and she allow him out when she feel like it. I knew this would happen, and if I'm lying, if I'm lying, Gil straighten me. Hey, everything he just said is facts. Like he said, he came he came to um. Like I said, all I know is me. I, I know he ain't lying to my company, Jahira. But uh, yeah, he came to us that same that same night. And let us know what had what you know what I'm saying had been happening over the you know what I'm saying past hey and, and Gibbs, let, hold on let me say this bro I called Jahara when I said when I said when you say you was waiting on me for the money then you start questioning me so you know I was like why why are you questioning me right so I said look you got that money only you don't gotta send me all of it or whatever just send me some because I need it because I was like shit at that time I didn't have I didn't have like the shit to go around the Christmas dinner. You see what I'm saying? I had food in my house. I didn't have the shit to go around it. You see what I'm saying? So everybody already know what it was, what was going on around that time. So uh I'm like, shit, I can use take that money and use it to go ahead and get, you know, the miscellaneous shit like the macaroni or whatever you put around your turkey. You see what I'm saying? So they got an attitude, like, cause I said something about the bread, bro. And I said on the phone to Faith. If somebody gave you something for me, then why are you even questioning me when I say they gave it to you for me? You see what I'm saying? Exactly, so, bro. So go ahead and try. And then the first thing she said when she got on the phone, you know, I guess she was expecting that if I said, uh, uh, when you said, can I speak to your wife? Like you was like, oh, I'm a, I'm a bust her, or I'm a bust him or whatever. So I put her on the phone. The first thing she said was, y'all ain't got no food in your house. So I took the phone and said, that's not what I told you. You did what I'm saying, bro? You try exactly. to spin it in your own little narrative. So when you ran this back, that you could try to play it like that. Which I spoke to Gibbs. 
I spoke to Jahara right after those calls. And they knew what was going on. Exactly, bro. You see, and, and, and I told you, bro, I said I knew it was gonna come to this. And yeah. you can you can you can put your screenshots up, you can spend it however you want. But just make sure you got the receipts for the rest of that money. I don't want it. Take it and give it to somebody else. Books don't need it. But you thought that when I came back, that I was gonna kiss your ass, kiss her ass. No, I can't be boy. I told you that. It's other people. It's other people. When that stuff first happened, I never asked nobody for nothing, bro. People that extended their hand. People that I was going back and forth with at one time that extended their hand. I was grateful for that. You dig what I'm saying, bro? Well, but I, I never asked nobody for nothing. Exactly. You see what we, I'm saying? We, man, we stressed that shit from the get-go, bro. I, I went live in the middle of the night that night, bro, because I saw what motherfuckers was finna be on. And I made that shit clear, bro. This man ain't asked for nothing. Yeah, and then it's like this. All right. Because this, this is what you do. See, because he, he thought he, y'all thought you would be slick. And, you know, like I say, bro, before it was even pointed out to me, all that leadership, I already knew where he was going with that. And then you try to put Rhett and Huggy in there. They don't got nothing to do with this, bro. Y'all want to come out and act like y'all big shot and y'all do so much for people. What bulls call your bluff? Where the rest of that money at? honey. Because you went around. What you said out your mouth, Faith, that you shared my story, which you didn't have my permission, with other people, which I can't control because I gave that to the people when I went live and shared that with y'all, right? So, uh, but you still did that. That was disrespectful. You went on Huggy Panel, went out your way to try to paint the narrative like you was the only one exclusively talking to me. And I was talking to Jahara, Boss Lady, and Gills the whole time. And they knew every step of the way what I was, what was going on. And they was calling me and texting me every day, checking on me. So, and when this happened, I said, damn, they did the video on Huggy Panel. I appreciate the video because even people that didn't like me at the time or ran with whoever I was going back and forth with, they even get, did videos. Man, sorry about it. But you was talking shit about all those people. The world knows the DC, which I told you. I said, bro, I'm trying to get my head clear. I'm not worrying about what no DC, what no world news saying. I don't give a fuck what them niggas saying. You see what I'm saying? Real talk. I ain't, I ain't care, bro. I don't care what no niggas saying if nobody believe it's real or not, dog. I ain't lied to nobody yet and I ain't got to lie. So who, who scamming what when I didn't ask you for nothing, but you collected money in my name in the name of my situation out of your mouth that you collected damn near $800. And you only sent $140 and you only sent it because you was afraid that Boogs was going to come on and blaze you about that. Right, because they, they was acting funny about sending that shit. You know what and man? you remember that, bro? I'm like, man, that, I'm like, that's crazy. Because like, like Jahara just said, they was being nosy. You just wanted to talk about my situation because at that time, whether people want to agree with it or not, the shit would back and forth with me straight drop, me and straight drop. Everybody was paying attention to that. A lot of them was just trying to tag along because y'all was just happy somebody was going at them because y'all couldn't do it. And like I say, this ain't this ain't no diss at nobody or whatever. This straight directly at JJ. Sit your goof ass down. Expose yeah. what? Exactly. Nigga, what did it's you... It's mighty funny that I come back and you went to it with T. Harrison because you told me that T. Harrison was part of the group that sent money for me. Don't know if it's true. This what came out of her mouth. So you lied to me around that time. Or, you know, then is it a coincidence that I come back in your name in the middle of some uh, 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 a scam, a scandal, whatever you want to call it. And let's be clear on this. It ain't no leader. I'm not no leader of nobody. They do their own thing. They got their own accounts. You the only one that follow around and want a leader and got to be in the group. Mm-hmm. And I stayed quiet because I watch you throwing little slick shots like y'all so perfect. Where the rest of that money at? I don't even want it, but donate that shit to somebody that need it because bugs don't need it. But don't say scam and all that. When y'all collected money, I didn't ask y'all for nothing. I, I was, and let me say this to be clear because bugs know, everybody know bugs. Bugs went through that shit with the workers' comp people, and I'm most grateful for anything anybody did for me and my family. That's a honey. You dig what I'm saying? But at, by no means, because you sent no little funk-ass $100, 
that that mean I'm gonna agree with everything you say, or I'm going up here and I ain't gonna laugh at what I want to laugh at or be where I want to be at. Expose it then, right? So Come I can show now. you screenshots of them 15 missed calls when you was wearing me, when when people were sending me emails, when you ain't even say, "Damn, let me get a man some space." He just lost his kid a day ago. I'm going to keep calling to be nosy so I can go on somebody else's panel and speak upon it. Like, let's talk about that. Let's talk about how disrespectful that was. Let's talk about how disrespectful it was when you never spoke to my lady. And the first thing come out of your mouth is, y'all ain't got no food name what I told you. So who scammed who? Who scammed who? Where's the rest of the money? You scammed the people you collected it from. And then it's mighty funny that, and I don't mean to put nobody else in this, but I remember a call when you and Faith called me in panic mode because Straight Drop found something out about y'all business or whatever that is. And as soon as that happened, I put two and two together and something triggered in my head. Like, man, something ain't right with them. Dig what I'm saying? And, that, yeah. and for me, that's what made me be like, oh, no, nah, I'm going to make sure somebody else know that so when this happened, because which I knew it happened, because I told you, bro, I said, I don't trust them because what they did the world. And I don't fuck with dude. I don't got no problem with them. I don't fuck with them. But y'all did them like that. So, and, and all y'all do is everything y'all do for people or whatever, y'all got to come tell everybody. Exactly. Yeah, they got to get that recognition for you, it. You, you, and you need it. And you need it because what was going on with books that you seen even the people... Even the people like straight dropping them that I was going back and forth with, even they made videos. So you thought it was a chance to, uh, let me see. I don't want to say clout chasing because they use that word too much. But you thought that was a perfect spot for y'all to get some attention on who y'all think y'all is. So you can, you know, you can do whatever. I can put my shit up. I can go live and crank up and drag you and all this because you mad because a nigga laughed at a joke when right, you sit on here like, and, and, and you sitting on here disrespecting all these all these women calling them all type of bitches and she sit there and allow that and you and, and, and then when somebody joking on you or yours it's a problem it's a problem man pull your fucking skirt down b real talk bro niggas bro, joke bro. every day b exactly yeah. man that's the, that's that goofy shit bro that's what i'm talking about but I, i'm gonna read something p smith just wrote real quick right. She said, uh, uh, wow. And remember, they specifically said that Bugs did not want to talk to nobody while he was going through. Exactly. Uh, and I and I told you, and listen, I even got messages and calls, bro, from people that I'm tight with. Like, why is they showing why is they showing that up there? You told them it's cool. I said, man, at the time, dog, I've just lost my kid, dog. To be honest, I told y'all I was all over the place. And I'm like, man, look, I don't even care because I don't want nobody to never think that I'm going to ever come to y'all and lie about anything. Anything I said, I always gave y'all proof and y'all seen it. See what I'm saying? So I'm like, this ain't nothing I don't do. Show it to them. You dig what I'm saying? And it's like, it, and you ain't do that out of good intentions. And you know why right. you didn't? You know why you didn't? Because it never get to this point. You, exactly. You talking fuck. about something with Gears doing. When I had a problem with straight drop, Gears ain't say, oh, I got a problem with straight drop because Bugs got a problem. He clearly stated that it was his problem. So you try to act like you saying something slick about exposing somebody. Clown, you expose yourself. And I ain't oh, even want to come and do that because like I told you, man, shit was down, bro. I was grateful for whatever anybody did for me, dog. Know what I mean? But it's funny that Gears, and I ain't going to say the other people name because people don't want to, you know, people said they don't want nobody to know what they doing or whatever but i never heard anything i never heard like y'all got up tight because i ain't come on youtube and want to be down with y'all like let's stop it bro expose what bro what you gonna expose that uh boogs lost his kid you pulled money in off of his off of what he was going through and then you sent him 140 and then you got nerd to act like you got them you know what i mean yeah. Like who you gonna okay. expose? You expose yourself. You shouldn't even did it because you, how do that look? Bugs going through that is already bad enough that you collecting money in my name and I didn't tell you to. Know what I mean? 
I didn't. I told yeah. you I didn't want nothing. I ain't want nobody to use this situation. There's no way to do nothing, dog. This was clearly about I. I used my platform to tell my to tell my story, my testimony, dog. And that was part of it, dog. And this how this how I get through. But you chose that. You weren't thinking about oh, I'm doing some good. Uh, help Bulls and his family. You was thinking about down the line who gonna say who gonna say and give you props about you sending a funk ass hundred and forty dollars. And I don't even want nobody to ever take it like Bulls ungrateful for nothing, dog. But be clear because you sent a nigga. I don't give a fuck what it was. I can't be bought. I told y'all that when I went through that other situation, dog. So who are you exposing but yourself? Where the rest of that money? Expose that. Expose the receipts to this family that just popped up that you somebody gave you money for booze, but you gave it to somebody else. Expose that. Exactly. Whatever receipts. I don't want no screenshots. I don't want to see no hangout messages because I got them too. I want to see um, how all of a sudden, and then tell them why y'all got so hostile with books. Why it was so much tension when I spoke on the money. Mm-hmm. That some and mind you, let's say this again: that somebody gave you for books, not because books acts, but because people wanted to do something for books. You dig what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it's like explain where the rest of that money at first. Uh, explain that, and then you pull your little hangout receipt out, your text message receipt out. Because what I told you, bro, I don't got nothing to hide. What you going to say? Uh, yeah, we, we had to send the, the bulls money and look out for him because uh, he had no food. No, I didn't tell you that. And I, I blazed both of them about that, and he stopped choking up. And she had to put his nuts back in the uh, handbag <laughs> to get the phone. <laughs> so all that gangster stuff you talked to Myron about doing something to him and all that, nobody trying to hear that, bro. Wow. Sit down, bro. You 115 pounds soaking wet, bro. Sit down. Sit down and show these people where they found this mysterious family that I gave, I got, I gave Gibbs money for Bam, but Gibbs take my money and give it to somebody else. That won't fund nobody else. That was for Gibbs. And like I say, I don't even want it. Take that shit and give it to somebody who need it because fortunately, God, I stay where I, I stay who I am and true to what I do. And I ain't put no bullshit out in the universe, and God bless me and my family. So um, take that and give it to somebody else who need it. Know what I mean? Real too Do that. Expose that, dog. Because, see, if we're going to be real on here, let's be real. Don't hide nothing from people. Don't lie. Don't try to spin it like you did some, some outrageous stuff for bulls. You sent me $140, but you collected $800. Your words. Play that conversation. And play that conversation when she took his nuts and put them back in the handbag because he couldn't <laughs> even talk. Play that conversation when you did when you didn't even you got on the phone of a grieving parent and didn't say I apologize for your loss, my condolences. And the first thing you come out of your mouth and then listen, bro, my girl, my girl, watch my videos. But if somebody emailed me, my girl don't be in all that. About you know, if somebody donate to the channel or whatever, she know, oh, his ass ain't been working, he's been on YouTube, somebody must have sent him something, and she get done with it. So when when you say something like that to my girl, she looking like, What the fuck she talking about? Right. You know what I mean? And she like, look, I don't know nothing about none of that. Now I mean what he do with fires that stuff on there. I he tell me, but I don't get into that. You know what I mean? And it's like, uh, then it's like when I said something, then you thought about it, and I ain't talked to them after that conversation for a couple of days, and then you popped up and like, yeah, well, uh, uh, I'm gonna send it, and I ain't even talked to him. I just gave the phone to my girl because I ain't even want to talk no more. Like you know, bro, you know how that make a a she just lost her baby, bro. A week before the baby was supposed to be born, bro. And then somebody get on the phone. You don't say my condolences. My girl don't even know you. The first thing come out of your mouth is you talking about something about some food. Right. And that wasn't what you was told, dog. And right. first off, let's, let's go back so we make sure everybody know this clear. That somebody gave you that for books. I should have to say 
Bugs, we waiting on you whenever you ready. The money is here. Why when Bugs say something, it's you got to get approval. People sent you their money, so why you got to get approval? They right. sent the money. All that trying to sound professional with the we move in a unit. Like, she thinks she's the leader. Get off the high horse and check yourself. And check yourself, dog. Y'all did this. While Boogs was worrying about making right. sure that his family was getting over the situation. My bad. Wrong word. Not getting over. But starting the healing process, you was calling me. Playing them games and then talking about what other niggas on YouTube were saying. You did what I, why, why would you do that? And I told you clearly, bro, I got to get my head clear right now. I don't know what to think no more. Like I told you, I felt hopeless. I like, I don't, what, what the fuck I care about YouTube for, bro? What's somebody saying? But talk, you was worried about that because you just wanted to be cool. Mm -hmm. You just wanted to be nosy so you can say, I talked to Boogs. Oh, look, mm -hmm. here go the memory box. Look, Boogs. Now, all of a sudden, when Boogs, Boogs don't acknowledge y'all, Boogs doing what he do, here you go. Talking all this leader shit and expose somebody. No, they're gonna laugh at you. They're gonna laugh at you. Not them lame ass jokes either. They're gonna right. laugh at you and wonder where they bread at. Real talk. Where that shit at? Niggas talk all this, this and that about what they do. And and you be on some bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Like the, yeah. the pudding, bro. And like you said, bro, this ain't even has shit to do with you, bro. This nigga was, was was so so pissed off at me and 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 all in his feelings in the bushes chat watching and shit that he said I don't know I don't know what the fuck he was thinking like you said bro ain't shit to expose bro like what, what you gonna bring out on me you wanna say this, bro. On and I want to say this I want to say this that time who was following me. Because even the niggas at the time that was making back and forth videos, niggas kept hollering, begging, and all that. And what I told y'all, I'm going to put my pride to the side and take care of mine because these people playing with my shit, right? will not nothing I could do. I never hear that or I never tried to, uh, yeah, I got mine figured out, uh, but I still need you. No. When I say I need, I oh, and that was the whole thing about, I'm like, damn, uh, People and you know I tri it, it was on I blame myself because I fell into it and thought damn people gave a fuck about a nigga so I'm like I right, well you know it is what it is and that was my fault know what I mean but it was people that was genuine about helping and they helping I never heard nothing but you get mad at a joke nigga and you sit on this bitch all day and joke on people talk about women talk about people mamas talk about people dead people and then you got a nerd to get mad because somebody say something about your wife. When she's sitting in the background giggling, when she should be telling you that you out of line for sitting up there calling this woman that's 50 years old, no disrespect, a bitch, a whore, and all that shit. Right. Come like on. That's cool. And let's not forget to mention, uh, you know, all the boss talk, the narcissistic attitude, you know, the high horse mentality, whatever you want to call it. Pipe it down, bro. Reality check. I told y'all. I ain't trying to do that. But I don't mind. I, I get on you all day, bro. I don't care about that. I ain't going to joke or none of that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to lay out facts. And you got to run and try to huddle up and get somebody to help you. But what I'm going to give you is facts. I ain't going to lie. That's it. And I got screenshots. I can go live from my page and do it. And I told Gills. I said, bro, I don't even want to. I hope nigga. Ain't. I said nigga talking about me, bro. I know right. a nigga. Ain't, cause everybody on here know that me and Gills cool. Everybody know that no matter what, that I got Gills back a hundred. He had my back a hundred. Everybody know I'm cool with Jahara. So nigga, you nigga, you try to say bugs on the low, but what you? Who are you going to expose bugs? See, cause this the funny thing. The same people that was talking all that shit, questioning everything. Them the same niggas I see on here now begging. But doing drugs while you live big. See what I'm saying? Real, hey, real shit. But see, you know one thing about bugs, bro. This real. I don't forget what I went through. I'm always stay humble. But you, you, you drag me in. It's like you had some exclusive on me. You don't got nothing, bro. But what I just said. 
You gonna say, oh, motherfucker, this, and then motherfucker gonna say, well, where the rest of the money at? Oh, you said on Huggy Live, Bugs didn't ask you for nothing. I can show you the screenshot. What three times? Bugs didn't ask us for nothing. We know we just want to help you. Please let us be a blessing to you and your family. But it won't a blessing. You just wanted to do it so you can come back in a couple months. And uh, if a nigga don't give you the credit for it, just like you did world, and brag about what you did, nigga, you sent a funk ass hundred forty dollars, and you can get that shit back straight up. You can get that shit back. But first, I need to see the receipts on who you sent that money to that you got in my name. And then I need you, if you can't provide that, to donate the rest of that money to a charity or somebody that really need it and let us see the receipts on that. Show those receipts. Not screenshots of a chat. Not you coming with them lame-ass, drawn-out jokes. Know what I mean? Not none of that. Yeah, Not none of that. I want to see that too, real talk. I, I want to see your screenshot so you can make yourself look like a fool and then say, damn. So they really did sit right there when that man was going through that and just be nosy and then do something so they could try to throw it back. Yeah. And I told y'all that night, bro. I said, I knew it was coming, bro. Yeah, bro. I'm and like, I was waiting. And, and you know, I told you, bro. I said, I'm waiting, bro. Because he exactly. don't do nobody's what y'all doing on here. Who else y'all collected money and they name and ain't and the person ain't got it all? Right. You kept trying to put Huggy and Wreck in there. They had nothing to do with it. I talked to Huggy about some other shit and I seen Wreck send a message and that was it. They ain't had nothing to do with it. But you had the money sitting, oh, you know, all that fake boss talk y'all do. Uh, the money right here sitting whenever you read it and man you. When they first told me that, bro, about two weeks, two and a half weeks took went by, right? Because remember at that time, I told you, I was like, oh, they supposed to, and Jahara, you know this. Uh, I was like, oh, they supposed to get my stuff straight and start sending me my checks every week from the workers' compensation. And right. they didn't. And I was like, oh, well, boom, just like I'm sure anybody else would. Oh, shit, well, they got the money that people sent them for me. I can reach out and get my bread then. Mm -hmm. Not my bread, but you know what I mean. Somebody said that them for them. To, right. I mean, to them for me Shit, in my it, situation. It, it, so it was me. It, it should have already been to you. You know what I'm saying? I shouldn't even had to say nothing, right? Exactly. I shouldn't have to say. That's I shouldn't have to say. I shouldn't have to say. Uh, I got to get shit to go around my Christmas dinner. I shouldn't have to say none of that. And then look, if I if I was if I if you say I scammed you, what I, I scammed or whatever the hell you said, uh. Um, y'all, you of your winning fire is to be like, well, we, oh man, y'all family, man. We ain't gotta be blood, man, to be family, man. I love you, brother. Uh, we love you, we family. Uh, we want to get little bugs on for Christmas. And what I told you, I said, no, I don't need nobody to get my son that for Christmas. Know why? Because when that shit first happened, when Robin them people reached out and sent me some, all that shit for Christmas. I was buying shit the months leading up to it, but before they cut the check off in October, I was buying little shit, and I took the rest of that to get the rest of it. So, um, this y'all already know by watching books, by watching even Straight Drop, Logic, even the people you know that kept saying begging or whatever. Right. You know what I mean? Even those people that said that, everybody knew that old books, the shit was fucked up. So then if, if I was trying to scam you or get over on you, I would have said, yeah, get them such and such. Get them this, right or wrong, bro. Because That's fact. Bro. I don't know. And, and let me be clear. Y'all hey. got to figure out and look up the word, bro, scam. Because, see, scam is if I tell you I got these Jordan infrared sixes for sale. You send me your money, and I send you a cardboard cutout of the Jordan. Then I scammed you. Uh -huh. Didn't scam you when I didn't ask you for anything. You extended your hand and you basically, like you said on on, on Huggy Live, you basically had to beg me to accept something. Right? Right. And and I don't even get why this nigga even did this shit to himself. You know what I'm saying? Like, like you said, bro, you exposed yourself, bro. Like I, I don't know what the fuck this nigga was on this morning, bro. But you real life, uh, like I said, bro, you, you barked up the wrong tree, bro. You you fucked up. I don't even know why. Like you said, bro, we we been new to this, bro. 
motherfuckers weren't finna say shit about shit, bro. Because it, it was what it was, but now you talking about exposing bro, somebody else. When, it, when this shit happened, bro, what I said, I said, man, before I left, all that shit was going on, bro. The back and forth shit. I felt like that boy. And to be honest, when that shit happened with my son, bro, I felt like that negative energy brought that shit around my family, bro. And that's on everything. And that's why I told you, I said, nah, bro, I ain't really tripping. They, I, they do them. I'm going to do me. Long as you don't put me in nothing because I'm trying to, you know, put a different energy around me and my family, bro. You know what I mean? And then, right. this ain't the first time I seen you say something slick. You know what I mean? But what it was, was you thought that because you sent the little $140, which I was grateful for. Like I said, I'm never one of those people. And I didn't ask you for it. Uh, you thought that that was like you buying me or something. And we all know that that's not possible. Because I don't. it don't matter what amount of money nobody sent. Donate. Whatever. Uh... I can't be bought, dog. I'm not gonna agree with you say because you sent a hundred dollars, bro. And like I said, you can get that hundred and forty dollars back once you show them receipts on that other alleged family that came out the blue. And you or you take that money and the rest of the money that you know that you didn't send and donate to somebody else, then I can send you that back. Then I can send you that back. Because yeah. one day, since we know we talking boss talk. When I said, when I first spoke on the money, y'all try to come up with Eddie, Eddie excuse how she was running around doing this in the community, what she do, you know, how you try to paint this picture like you do so much for everybody else. And you so Jesus Christ righteous, uh, lying in the name of Jesus, basically. Um, You say you couldn't get to the Walmart because the truck wouldn't stop. So, like, bruh. I don't know why you people do this, dog. You you come at people indirectly, like you like you hold something over them. Cause if I do, and let me say this, it's been people that have done stuff for here, and I never mentioned it, and I never mentioned it, dog. And I'm never going to because I felt like doing that, and I want to do it from my heart. But you don't hold nothing over me because you sent no hundred dollars, nigga. Who you thought you was? Your truck wouldn't even stop. Quit all the boss talk, bro. Right, like, right, but he he talking about bro. Uber car. Yeah, like cut it out, bro. What you what what, what you gonna expose, bro? Like <laughs> you expose, you played yourself with this donkey of the day. Congratulations, you played yourself. Hey, real talk, donkey of the day. <laughs> like straight up, man. Shit. Like straight up, dog. And 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 gives you notice and anybody else. I always been open with everybody about everything. I always been open with everybody about everything, dog. When when I needed shit and I asked for it. Did y'all or did y'all not hear me say, hey, y'all can hit my PayPal. I would appreciate it. I need it. Right or wrong, bro? Right. Even when niggas was saying, oh, they begging and whatever the case may be. I, I kept it solid with everybody. I kept, I'm an open book, man. I don't have nothing to hide. But y'all do. Because when uh y'all was in panic mode when you called and said, man, Trey Drop found this out. He know he know how much money I got where I live at, and he know about my business. So show the receipts on why you was out nervous about that also, because you just was saying you gonna pull up on Myron and whoop his ass and all that old fake fluffy gangster shit you talking, you know. So um, <laughs> but you was scared to death then, cause you was panicking on the phone. Play that recording. Play that. Right. Play that. Yeah. Play that. See, that's the thing, bro. On here. People won't do that, bro. People won't say where what they did. They always trying to keep themselves in a, in a certain type of light, bro. A picture, uh -huh. like so people see them a certain type of way. With me, I let people see shit was fucked up for me. I let them see when I was angry. I let people see when I was when I sat down and did that live and told people about what happened, bro. That shit was tearing me up, bro. I, people seen me break down and cry. I don't feel no type of way. I don't feel soft. I ain't. I ain't uh ashamed of that. People yeah. seeing me laugh. People seeing me joke. Bro, I don't have shit, bro. I don't yeah. care how nobody see me. But what you won't do is like I told y'all before, you won't lie on me. And you know the fucked up part, bro, is deeper than that money shit or whatever they talking about. Is you didn't even take into consideration, like I said, this man just lost his child. Yeah. So worry about yourself. 
And, so who? And you, saw, you saw how I said earlier, like, bro, I'm glad I didn't give you my real number. You ain't finna be blowing me up every day, back to back to back to back. Like, bro, who the fuck calls somebody that constantly, bro? Like, god damn. Especially after somebody just lost a child, bro. Like, damn, if I ain't picking up, bro, I must not want to talk or, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing something or I'm I'm, I'm going through it. I don't feel but, like talking. Whatever but, the case, bro. But, but Gills, this the thing. I told the nigga, just like I told you, bro, and I sat on the phone in tears talking to you, bro, like, dog, I don't I don't get it, bro. This this year, bro, I had everything taken away from me. And I told a nigga, like, I ain't in it, I ain't, in it, bro, I gotta clear my head. And I even went as far as the, like, yo, bro, my bad about the missed calls, no disrespect, bro, I just gotta clear my head. And you still was calling, still was telling me what a nigga on YouTube was saying. Like, what type of, that was no courtesy. Yeah, that was no courtesy. Lying in the name of Jesus, man. Jesus don't like that. Yeah, that's why, I, shout out to my nigga Myron, Microwave Christian. Yeah, <laughs> like, and, and, and like I said, this was gonna get them, Gibbs. This was gonna get you when they show those receipts and I gave y'all the story. You're gonna see how the narrative gets spent. But guess what? I never put my lady on the screen, my lady never had nothing to do with that. But she know everything. So, like I said, it ain't even had to be all this because guess what. When I heard it, I hit the nigga. I called the nigga. I called the nigga. I sent the wow. nigga a message. Like, dog, why you put me, why you put me in something that got to do with somebody else? You got my nine, you got my you got my number. My line always open. So you ain't man enough to call me because faith won't home from work. So you had to come on and sneak this. You won't man enough to call, you won't man enough to answer the phone, dog. So cut all the gangster talk out, bro. Sit down somewhere, bro. Sit down yeah, somewhere. Bro. And get and when she get home, get your nuts out the handbag and go live with them lame ass jokes and clean that mess up and show these people where the rest of that money at. Or you lie, or you get busted in a lie. Either way, it's a catch twenty two for you. You lose. One hundred. <laughs> you lie, <laughs> or <laughs> you kept people money. Real talk. Just saying, like y'all just say like, thank you, man. Like, like people just run out for most say anything, shawty. Like, yeah, bro. That's why I'm like, hey, I told him in the chat. I told him in the chat. I said, I said, I'm working. Keep talking. I re I real life was working. I ain't want to seem like I was uh just letting this nigga talk to me how he wanted, but I saw where it was going. Like, nigga, you finna take this shit somewhere you ain't you don't want it to go, bro. So keep talking. I'm working. Yeah, and it's it just it just crazy, bro. Like, cause just like the other situation, bro. Like certain shit is just like you let people do them. Like I was trying to tell people when I did that live. Like sometimes just let people do them, bro. They'll play themselves. Like they you let them if you let a person talk enough, they'll talk themselves straight into a corner and tell on themselves. Now, all of a sudden, you caught up in some 10K scam. Like, just, I mean, you know, it is what it is, man. Like I say, pull your receipts. <laughs> I got by. I'm ready, whatever. But know this. The only person that can get exposed is you and your wife for uh, lying, fraud, because, you know, lying is fraud. That's fraud, too. Yeah. Uh, being disrespectful to me losing my son, being disrespectful to me and my family, and um, that's fine too. Yeah, that, yeah, that's fine too. You know, or you, you scam them people. Those people should be reaching out to you. Like I just seen books on Gills Live. Where's my money? And who is this? Y'all don't think it's mighty funny that. Like I said, everything was cool. It was brother, love you, brother, love you, brother, man. All that old, you know, that backyard uh, moonshine talk. Uh, it was all that fake love shit. Yeah. When I said something about the money, you got hostile. And even with that, I was like, oh, you know, maybe they ain't seeing what 
or catching what I'm catching. Uh, six. Wow. But I'm like, you know, I'm like, I if 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 I get some money, if I ain't even gonna say it because I don't want to happen no bad. But if I'm getting something for somebody, dog, and I'm collecting some, I'm not holding on to it because I don't want nothing to happen. And somebody say, oh, well, I gave my money to books for gears and something happened. Why would you be holding something somebody gave me talking about uh uh talking about uh we we waiting on you everybody want to send everything at one time i gotta go to my group real youtubers uh you know and discuss this but if everybody sent you everything why would you have to go back and say hey can we send it because they entrusted you with their money to get to books but it never made it there $140 made it there. Man, you what an attitude. What an and attitude. you know what? <laughs> it was just so crazy, bro, because I'm like, dog, and and it more won't even me, bro. But when she got on the phone with my lady, Charlotte, like, I felt so crazy because I'm like, I did not tell you that. So you done went in your head and painted the picture already of what type of shit you gonna come up with. Wow. And, and let me tell you this, bro. Now you know when you dealing with somebody, bro. And ah. I right, let's say I do something for you, but I start faking a little attitude so I don't gotta do it. Like that type, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, like, yeah, that type yeah. Thing, I'm gonna be real with you, you gills. No matter what, I'm gonna hold you down. And then you like, hey, bro, you know, goddamn man, suck my car broke down, man. I gotta get to work, and I be like, man. Shit crazy, man. Nigga to piss me off all oh, yeah, and I'm faking mad. And so yeah. they try to they try to change the direction of the conversation. Exactly. But bro, that look on my lady face when I'm like, so you don't get on the phone and say, hey, this faith, uh, sorry about your loss. You like, hey, you ain't got no food. And I'm like, whoa. Like, just imagine that, bro. You just lost your kid. And you speak to somebody, and I'm like, why the hell all of a sudden you want to speak to my lady? So what you on? What? Why would you even be like? Cause that made me think like you was questioning me. And then I'm like, why would you question me when I didn't ask you for anything? Somebody gave you something for me. So why? Why? Why are you trying to interrogate me basically for some somebody gave you for me? And like I said, the end of the day, dog, whatever the fuck your intention was, I'm grateful because at the end of the day. Everybody know what I went through. I ain't asking nobody to feel sorry for me or none of that. Because I don't need pity. Uh, but don't come up here, dog, and shoot shots. <laughs> and ain't got a bulletproof vest on. Know what I mean? Like, real talk, dog. Either way you see it, you played yourself. You played yourself. <laughs> know what I mean? Straight up. And I still, that one time, me telling y'all this, I still didn't disrespect her. Right or wrong, bro. I ain't call her out her name. Because guess what? Bulls don't do that. I ain't call you out your name. I ain't doing no whack-ass jokes. I'm being real here. Because you painted this picture to these people like you had something to expose. Like you like you so high and mighty. Like uh, I do a lot of stuff for people on these YouTube streets and all that old backyard moonshine shit that can't nobody understand. When at the end of the day... Either way you paint this picture, you lose. Because you did fucked up shit at a fucked up time. When it's crazy, when even the people I was going back and forth with, bro, had even, even if a motherfucker took it down and said some crazy shit, at least at that moment, bro, they had enough sense and compassion to stop. To stop. But the shit you did was worse than a motherfucker sitting up here talking about, is it real? Because bulls always tell y'all what? Question everything you see, man. Cause shit's so crazy out here. I always said that. And when people and when you when we talked talked about that, bro, what I said, I said, yeah, that shit wild that a motherfucker will say it. But I ain't tripping because I always say people gotta question everything because you don't know what type of shit going on. Right, bro. Right? You won't even tripping on it like that. Like you said, like the motherfuckers gonna get theirs. And like you said, bro, look at these motherfuckers now, bro. Like, look at look at how they uh Conducting themselves on YouTube, they talking about somebody else, but you on here begging and shit. You know what I'm saying? It's like, 
man. But but you got uh, but man, bro, smoke, got drugs every day though. But you know what I'm saying? Like I said at the end of the day, man. Um, it is what it is. You know what I mean? And the only reason I spoke on this because I was bored into this. You know what I mean? And it's right. and it's and it's dividing shit y'all trying to do with all these psychological terms like leader and all that. Man, cut it. Man, cut it. Y'all got y'all y'all uh you know reunited and you know made amends with what y'all going through. Keep pushing. Don't keep acting like y'all know gods on here, bro. Y'all know about it, bro. Y'all know about it. Y'all just an old ass couple from Memphis. That's on here lying in the name of Jesus. And guess what? I'm just Boogs, a nigga that was in the chat that happened to get a channel and people took a liking to. That's it. But you ain't going right. to play me. By no mistake. You ain't going to play me. Show your receipts. Show us who that uh, family was. Or show us the receipt of you sending uh, whatever the difference was to a, to somebody that needed. That's a hundred. Yeah, and I want to see, cause, cause like you said, bro, this shit is a lose lose for him, bro. So I want to see if this nigga actually gonna try to come out like he exposing some shit. Cause your best bet is to just just shut up and don't say nothing. You know what I'm saying? Keep on pushing. Uh, go at whoever you want to go at next. But this situation, you, you your best bet is to leave it alone. Cause the it, case closed, bro. Real talk. And like I, I said. If I mean cut you off, bro, but oh, like good. I said, I can go on my channel with my computer and show y'all these messages. Yo, I can show you these messages. Well, at the end, you whatever that video was, like uh, Huggy did, and I ain't putting them in this because I ain't got no problem with Huggy. That's my dude. Uh, and show y'all. And you can hear I heard my books didn't reach out to us and ask us none. We want to do this for books. And then you ran to people and collect this shit. At least that's what you said. So which one is it? Did you collect the shit or you collected and kept it? Which one is it? It's no in between. There's no excuses. Answer that question. Get these people that you running around trying to be the crowds you trying to be accepted in. Like you keep claiming everybody else doing. Get them the truth, man. Don't put my name in nothing, bro. Because like I said, I'm going to give people the real. I don't have no reason to lie to people. Everybody know. They watch those videos. And my videos still on my channel, just on private, because I ain't want my shit to be like that. But my videos still there. I've always been the same person. Open book. Gave y'all the truth. Gave y'all my life. Up, down, down, up. Like a Nintendo code. Right. So... It is what it is, man. You you put me in that, bro. And I'm not sitting back letting you you gonna sit back and shoot no shots at me indirectly. I'm gonna answer it. Just get that bread. All I got was $140. I'm grateful for that. But where the rest at? Answer that. Now go run along. Cause this is what you're gonna try to do. You're gonna try to add you want you wanted to get back in the team so you can get everybody to help y'all and try to uh suck up their viewers. Cause ain't nobody watching you play Marvel versus Capcom. Um, you with your Spider Man hats and Spider Man shirts, like a big ass teenager. Um, nobody, um, nobody watching y'all. So you want to go try to suck up niggas' viewers? Y'all kiss. Now I ain't gonna say y'all because I don't want to disrespect your wife. I don't disrespect women, but you kiss ass to be cool with niggas because of their viewers. And then you trying to turn this into some team shit. Guess what? I've been said this. I'm a one man army, dog. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have gears back. You try to slick talk Jahara. I'm gonna have her back. Real one thing about it, they one of them did no fraud shit. shit. They one of them did no fraud shit. They one of them ain't got no money in, in the name of my situation, and the money just disappeared to some, you know, uh, wherever that shit at. Probably in your motherfucking bank account. Straight hey, up. Hey, <laughs> Ain't no telling. And go on, go on, say something stupid like, uh, you probably gonna try to be because I because I didn't put y'all on blast, try to say something about my deceased son or whatever. Bruh, you know, you niggas on the internet, y'all, y'all do that. Y'all get yeah, on the computer. I, I hope he don't take it that far, but I know he he one of them disrespectful ass niggas that take it that far. 
Yeah, I mean, you know, that what niggas do because you see how far a nigga took it because you said that people say you look like Predator too, which that's a fact. People said that when joking on Gills. So exactly, bro. You if think it I'm went, here, huh? if it you went, to, if hey. it went this far, bro, if it went this far, bro, then don't nothing surprise me. Hey, hey, you can't, you can't escape the situation. You expose hey. yourself because right. now people looking like where that money at. Real talk. Hey, but hey, Buzz, look at it like this. Uh, he be having Alicia over there kicking in with his chat. And he was just talking about, oh, I thought we was cool. I thought we was brothers, this, this, and that. Oh, well, Alicia called me predator. Am I supposed to be mad? Or oh, you you over there uh kicking in with Alicia, blah, blah, blah. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Like, like, that's like that's it's like this. Look, you over there with the same niggas that was running on here saying that I would have the audacity. I don't know why I would to have the audacity to show you a fucking box and and say and and be emotional and, and couldn't control it and say I lost my kid. Like I'm gonna get like I got that much time to sit up here and be worried about coming up here telling people shit. My life, what I go through. You know what I mean? And yeah. guess what? It was it was more than I'm gonna say this, bro, and be real, bro. Even people that diss me, whatever, that come with the game with going back and forth on YouTube, understandable. Know what I mean? Uh, but even them, even them, some of them people lost a child. You dig what I'm saying? And, and you took my situation, you took my situation, me losing my child, and try to spin it so you would look good. Yeah, like, bro. About you. And we talked about that, bro. When, hey, when I talked to you, bro, I'm like, damn, bro. That shit was kind of, it, it seemed like they was trying to get some attention, bro. Just because, like you said, bro, they was trying to make it seem like they was the only one who talking to you. And, and this, this, and that. Don't reach out to you because you don't want to talk to nobody. Like, hold up. Like, I, I know Another lie. can't say that because it's, it's, y'all not the only ones talking to them. So why would you talk to you like this? Why would you be saying a- something like this? But that was another like lie, right? I, I said, yeah, I sat back and watched that shit. But like I said, when we talked, bro, we talked about that shit, bro. And you, yeah, bro, it's like shit like that, bro. I be motherfuckers don't be knowing, bro. But like I said, bro, ain't nobody says shit about shit until this nigga want to go on this crazy ass rant yep. and expose yourself. You you fucked yep. yourself, bro. And, and and bro, you and I and I said and I said, bro, I don't want to do no type of shit like that because. Regardless of what their intentions was, at the end of the day, bro, they still, it's still, it's it, the one for it or whatever. I'm looking at it like, man, that was a blessing, right? Regardless of the fact. But it's like, you basically try to, you thought the 140 was going to buy, like, some some credibility to what you say y'all do. Right, you, you try to take advantage of me losing my kid for your image. Like what? Like has you Jesus Christ Psalms twenty three five and all that old shit have faith read Romans, but you try to you try to take advantage of a person losing a kid. Yeah, no fuck yeah. how tough you is. I don't care how many how many years you did in jail. None of that shit. I don't care been shot. All that shit don't none of that shit equate. To a doctor telling me that. And instead of like everybody else sending me an email uh backing off, you was persistent. I didn't answer the phone for you still call. And then for you to come down all these months, like um, not even all these months, a month and a half later, and try to put it out there, like you exposing somebody, you expose yourself, clown. Expose yourself, bro. Man, man, say, way, say you bro. beat up bugs and 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 all that and you know, if the car start, get you a jump, and I'm in Richmond. But all that other stuff, you ain't exposing nothing but yourself, player. That's just what it is, man. Yeah, that's just what it is, real talk. But like I said, bro, I want to see, I want to see, like you said, when, when Faith get home and, you know what I'm saying, he, he, he get his pair back out the purse, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, because she got, you know, she, you know, like I said, and it's a fact, and tell them play this recording. When, when I when I when I took the phone from my girl, how he got choked up and couldn't even get a word out, 
and she had to come in and talk for him. And she was being hostile and hoping that I cussed her out. You know, I, she was trying to bait me to cuss her out, but I still was respectful. Right. I still, because guess what? That's who I am. Any situation I deal with dealing with women, I'm going to say what I got to say without disrespecting you. And that's just what it is. But she was trying to bait me into like an argument or me yeah. just so you can say, I ain't sending them shit. Uh-huh. But make sure when you go live that you point out that Boogs didn't ask you for anything. All Boogs said was, you got money from people for my situation. If you got it and it's right there, what's wrong with you sending me something somebody sent you for me? That's all I ask. And then you got, you know, in your feelings. And now you done pulled your skirt up and, you know, twerking and all that. I don't know, man. I told you, bro, like, the psychological effects of YouTube, bro. Like, people burnt out, bro. Like, it's it's no point. It's no lines drawn in the sand. Like, you will do anything to have people look at you in a certain light. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yep, basically, yep. Straight up, man. And all this shit is facts. Make sure you tune in when he posts his, uh, you know, posts his little shit up so you can see exactly what Boog said. And then it's going to fuck you up when everybody laughing at you and you back to playing Capcom versus Marvel with two people in there. That's it. <laughs> funny, funny. <laughs> it's it just funny how everything changed. See, because Boogs was down and it was Boogs begging and Boogs this. And then you fast forward a couple months and then everybody else is you know they they discombobulated it's yeah. you're doing whatever it takes for somebody to watch you you will even go to the point where you will fabricate shit to get people attention like at the end of the day however you see it y'all try to take advantage of somebody else's situation and i don't even like to say that and make it seem like you know nobody feel bad for me but y'all took advantage of a fucked up situation that's it Straight up, man. I don't know why. Yeah. I don't know why it dropped me off like that. Uh, yeah, but I mean, like I said, at the end of the day, bro, now nah, I mean, I, I appreciate you having my back because you ain't had to text me and tell me what somebody was saying and, and yeah, boogs, you know I'm down on niggas for you. You ain't had to do that. You know what I mean? And, right. already know. It, it is, and you know the people that said what they said they going through their own shit and guess what I'm praying for them dog what I told you bro I ain't tripping off no nigga I'm praying for them niggas that's on here uh, smoking weed and saying they need money to take care of their kids yeah that's you know what I mean I'm well, praying for them now I'm talk. even at the end of the day bro I don't even got no animosity toward them bro I ain't called her out her name I ain't got no animosity but <laughs> Like I said before, bro, I won't be lied on, bro. I'm going to defend my name, bro. It is what it is, man. And like I said, I appreciate you having my back, bro. I appreciate, you know, the, the times that you that you, you you hollered at me and sent me bread and you ain't come on your panel like, oh, I talked to Boogs. Look, this, this, uh, his baby box and, uh, uh, I sent Boogs, uh, a hundred dollars or, you know what I mean? I yeah, appreciate bro. that, my nigga. Yeah, I you already it. know, bro. I don't, I don't, I don't even... I don't never need no recognition for none of that shit, bro. I'd rather not tell nobody about shit, you know what I'm saying? Because motherfuckers start start talking down on people and shit like this. Like, ain't nobody got time for that shit. But like I said, bro, when when I give, bro, I, I really like give to give, bro. I don't need no recognition for shit. And like I say, it's another person that's in the chat right now that went beyond, above and beyond, even when I didn't call them, talk to them, to reach out to me and my family and whatever. I mean, you know who you is, much love to you, and I'm going a, I'm to a defend my people regardless, dog. I, I let y'all sit around and lie like y'all was got them so righteous and all that, and I ain't care. You were sitting, I helped people on these YouTube streets and all that old shit. Man, look, it is what it is, man. You know what I mean? But I'm going to go where I want to. Support who I want to support, and if anybody sent me any money, I hope y'all didn't think uh back then that you was buying me or nothing. 
And truth be told, I know a lot of them came around because y'all thought a certain person was a god on YouTube. Because I was in phone conversations with you, the same people, when, oh, we've been trying for a year to expose such and such. I knew niggas was frauds. You just jumped on the bandwagon, bro. Right. Facts is facts. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, you know, I'm always up for a smoke session. You can always get that. You know what I mean? <laughs> especially when hey. a nigga asking for it. Hey, yeah. Especially when, you, you know, asking for it. And guess what? Like I said, before any of this, I reached out at 153. I called. I called at 153. And then I um sent you a message. At right, 153. Right. And mind you, like I said, I ain't had a because I deleted um all that shit out of my phone before I came back to YouTube. I don't never leave like numbers and messages because you know I the hangout should be there because you don't use that shit every day. Um, because you know, like I said, these people live off of having personal conversation with you, recording them, and hoping one day that y'all fall out or do something for y'all to fall out so they can say, "Oh, look what look what such and such put, or look what such and such did this." That's it. I told y'all before that this is what people live off. Uh. Or that type of shit. You can't even be on the phone call nobody because they want to record you and, and screenshot messages. But guess what? In the hangouts, it worked that way. 153. Since you called you on the hangout and messed you on the hangout. No, you didn't answer. So this is what it is. You mentioned my name and I told Gills. I said, I ain't hear my name. I know he said some indirect shit about because uh, of your boy and all that. And the leadership was it, bro. Like that—that that was it for me. Like leader, bro. He, he said he gonna expose the whole camp, bro. He said he said the whole camp gonna be laughing at you. Yeah, said, like. Oh, and then what do you mean by camp? Like, bro, I'm not. I don't even. To be honest, bro, I don't know what no takeover shit was. Like I told you, right. I've been watching people channels in and out, but I don't know what no. Oh, we team takeover. We team this. I ain't, bro. Bro, I always been a one man army, bro. And I had people with me that they they own one man or one woman army. That's just what it is, man. Ain't no team, man. We ain't got to huddle up. Exactly. We ain't got to huddle up and do all that. We, we just a bunch of solid motherfuckers. You feel me? Yeah. And guess what? Um, hashtag, uh, where that bread? <laughs> where that bread? For real, though. <laughs> <laughs> run that shit. Yeah, run that, run that bread to somebody out there going through something since you're so charitable. Like, run that. Run that to the people. Uh, you know what I mean? Because, you know, all of a sudden, uh, <laughs> a family popped up. Like, man, get that, people's, get that shit to somebody who going through something right I need it, man. That's a hundred, man. You know what I mean? Yeah, for real, though, bro. You know what I mean? Like, I ain't got to get up here and tell y'all who I help. When I help, uh, who I sent it to, what they was going through. I ain't got to show you what they going through. I ain't got to do that for no credibility, man. It's either I'm going to give you what I give you. Look at my background. Look what I told y'all and look at shit where it sit today. I never lied to y'all about anything. So take it for what it's worth. You pull those screenshots up. I got them too. And then we, you know, but make sure in the process of all that, we answer this one question. Where that bread? <laughs> Cause I know you have a hard time reading this shit. Where that bread? Straight like that. Oh, that's one honey. Hey, hey, hey. I'm gonna... <laughs> go ahead, bro. Hey, my niggas, Gills told y'all, man, you bugging up the wrong tree, bro. Man, I tried to tell him, but like, but, but. Man, I don't, I don't know what got into this nigga, man. Like, this, so she could supervise this nigga. Yeah, but I told you, I told you, bro. Like with the YouTube, motherfucker be getting it like a distorted mindset, bro. Where they feel like you get a YouTube channel and some people watch you because you talking about somebody that that mean you somebody. Know what I mean? Well, answer the YouTube. Streets or whatever y'all call it, want to know where that bread? Cause it's so it, it's so missing. <laughs> it's so missing. <laughs> where that bread, y'all? Cause 
You ain't got to ask Boogs. Um, you know, bring your receipts on, uh, you know, you scam who. So you will be exposed and then y'all can get off YouTube and y'all can't run the game no more. Because if you did it this time, bro, I'm pretty sure this ain't the first time. Yeah, that's that's what I'm that's what's going through my mind. Shit, honestly, that's what's been going through my mind since you told me that shit. Way yeah, back, like, you know what I'm this can't and then be all this shit come out. You know what I'm saying? I ain't really even trying to get into it, but as I'm listening, I'm like, damn, that shit sounds similar. You feel me? And that's crazy. I even, and I, <laughs> I ain't even talking about with the 10k. You feel me? I'm talking about just hearing what I'm hearing. You feel me? Yeah, and I and that, I told you what I said. I said, damn, as soon as I come back, and even my girl was like, that's them people. Like, she heard her voice and was like, that's them people. What they talking about? Who got scammed out some 10,000? Right. She she recognized the voice. Oh, that's them, huh? Like, that's crazy. Because she knew what they did. And she right. was like, that's crazy that now you come back and it's some crazy shit going on with them in it. What a coincidence. Uh-huh. What a crazy. Yeah, man. Yeah. Well, guess what? Jesus just spoke through me, man. Jesus said, where that bread? That's what Jesus said. Jesus said, where that go out at? You heard me? Yeah. Hey, uh, Auntie P just said in the chat, she said, we have a list of people they have done the same stuff to. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow. Shout out to the church. <laughs> Shout out to the church. Wow. That's crazy, bro. Wow. Man. That's well, crazy. at least I crazy. know, um, you know, <laughs> it's crazy, boy. She, he, said, she said, what would Jesus do? <laughs> get that bread back. Get that bread back. For real, though. Get that bread. Sit, sit a bottle of wine, motherfucker. <laughs> it, it, then it'd be crazy, bro, because people be so... Calling they self, calling people out, and you ain't even got your own shit cleaned up. Like, like that's that's what be tripping me out. Like, how's you on here, bro? Talking crazy, and you in a in a cesspool of mess. Real talk. <laughs> like, and you got a nerd talking about you gonna call, you gonna expose the leader and bugs and man, you played yourself, clown. Like you ain't gonna do nothing but talk behind your camera when when uh when your wife get home, you know what I mean? Or try to run over to and and throw somebody else in this and he gonna get his smoke too. No, nah, this this what he gonna do? He gonna get his boy world news, his his buddy boy world news. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, do. And, and now think about it, bro. Y'all say y'all was so called defending defending. My situation to people now, y'all buddy buddy kissing ass with them. Right, right. right. On, nigga, nigga called your wife out her name, bro. And now all of a sudden is man, whatever. That's cool. Y'all made amends, man. Don't put me in nothing, bro. Where that right. It, it, you're right. You can be cool with whoever you want to, but but now you want to knock out Myron because he called Faith a bitch. But but you on world news, buddy, buddy. Now I mean, that's man, you been cool. calling P. Smith out her name, man. Listen, I ain't right. even know what was going on, bro. But I'm watching it like, damn. I thought them and P. Smith was cool, bro. Now 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 she a uh, 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 I ain't even gonna repeat it, but she all these names and your wife, bro. My lady won't allow me to do that in my house, bro. That shit foul, bro. And this is coming from Christians, bro. Yeah, nigga, you supposed to be able to look past that, bro. Man, come on, bro. If, if, if you're going to go back and forth, nigga, at least clean it up, bro. Like, damn. Like, you you go on the the, the most disrespectful is rampage, bro. And, and think it's cool, bro. But then yeah. they want to come over here and talk about how you do this, this, and that, bro. When that ain't even what you say it is, bro. Come on, man. Like you said, bro, this, this nigga pulled a... a Shot himself in the foot, bro. You, you shot yourself. Yeah. You fucked up. And like I say, bro, you know, whatever they was doing on here, it won't my place to come on here and just talk about Pete because that, that wasn't what I was focused on. But it's like, if you speak, you dragging me into something, dog. Like, I'm over here doing me, like, trying to get my shit built back up with people that's worried about 
what I'm worried about, and then you throw me in some clout chasing. Because cause this is what you thought Boogs back, people watching Boogs, let me throw him in some, because I got my team back. Man, we ain't worried about, I ain't worried about no team. You can come up there with your wife. I still ain't going to call her out her name. You know what she did. She know what she did. She know what you did. You know what you did. Either way you see it, it won't Christian like, what would Jesus do? Ask yourself that before you go live. What would Jesus right. do? What would Jesus do? What would Jesus do? <laughs> now, all of a sudden, man, I, and I ain't even going to detail about other shit, but they know I can. Like, so, you know, just don't, you can come back with your response video, show your receipts, play yourself, and then your whole Jesus thing, like you keep saying, or be debunked. Be debunked. It'll, it'll be over with. Now, you sitting right there calling your wife, whining, man, boogs, do do do, man. Boo, what are we supposed to do? What would Jesus do? <laughs> hey, you, you better tell Faith what you did, motherfucker. You, you, y'all, she got you, he got you into some shit, Faith, for real. Yeah, tell, tell her how you think, goddamn. Um, tell her you brought me in this. And I, and I, I already knew. I already knew from the jump, bro, that he felt some type of way. Because I guess they thought I supposed to came back and be like, the, the Robinsons, they said 140. Like, went crazy for it. Right. Like, you think, like, when you do shit for people, bro, it ain't about uh, them acknowledging uh, what you come. And even when I came back, what I said, bro, shout out to the Robinsons, shout out to such and such. But the whole time you've been throwing slick shots, nigga, I don't care about you putting no message up because I said, where the money at that people sent you for me? I don't care nothing about that. You can't expose me. And guess what you can't do either? In the humblest way possible, you can't say bugs bro. Oh Remember that. You can't G-check me. You can't. I told you. I'm unexposable. You can't expose nothing about me because I give people the real shit. I ain't y'all. I ain't coming up here telling people that my... uh. Whatever slick saying you want to say that 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 I ain't uh what you call that I'm perfect and Jesus molded me in His image and I do everything through Jesus' eyes. I ain't doing all that, but if I help somebody, they ain't gonna never have to hear about it. I don't give a fuck what they say. That I'm never gonna drag them into it because you got mad because a nigga say your wife look like predator and he said well they say I look like predator. Nigga, you joke on people all day, nigga. Right. Hey, ain't ain't that the crazy thing though that I didn't even I didn't even send a shot at his wife. That's yeah. what, like man, even if I did, bro. This ain't had nothing to do with you, nigga. Hey, oh. like you said, hey, and like you said, bro, you hit this nigga up before we did this live, bro. Y'all could have he he could have talked about it, squashed it right then and there, bro. I still probably would have went live and talked my shit about what I was going to talk my shit. It was like I had no input. Right. I I can't say nothing, bro. This nigga don't put me in it. Cause guess what? Your beef with him is your beef. Exactly, bro. I was gonna get up here talk my shit about what this nigga was talking about, bro. Man, bro. Nigga. I, like I said, I, I been knew this shit, bro. If I wanted to bring this shit to the table, bro, I could have been did it. <laughs> it just, it just, it's just funny, dog. Like people think, like what you thought you was gonna come on here and say. Uh, yeah, we had to send Boogs money, try to spend it that way when you were supposed to send me that soon as the people sent it to you. Like I said, it's either you lied and just tried, and that show everybody that you just were trying to be nosy during my situation, my time of grieving, or you, those people need to say, where's my money? Right. Where's my, where's my money? Where's hey, my I'm, money? Um, I'm gonna, uh, you step away real quick. All uh, right, like, where's my money? That's it. And like I say, you had my number. So all that slick shit you doing on YouTube for attention, you could have called me because I reached out to you and said, why you put my name and shit? Then I, I called you first, then messaged you like, bro, why you put my name in something? You got my line, hit me. But no, you can't do that because you got to get permission. You got to get faith to sign the permission slip for you to say something. Come on, man. You can't run game on me, period. And you ain't gonna run nothing I'm doing. I don't care nothing about what you put up. Ain't none of that. It ain't nothing. No, no, everybody know. Oh, man, well, before that happened, Boogs was on his channel 
or uh, or uh, saying that workers comp what I show you, I can show you everything just like I did before. But mighty funny, you sit and call the nigga a scammer, a hacker, uh, all those names, and now you right there with them. So that makes you that mean hold on, that makes you, and that means you condone scamming and hacking. That's wow. what came out of your mouth. Your mouth. So go be a clown, make some whack jokes, play yourself, and then you sit and you lay on her chest because she the man of the house. She wear the pants in the house. No, 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 no disrespect. Like she look like a man tonight because I don't do that. But she she wear the pants in your house. You lay on her chest tonight with your thumb in your mouth <laughs> and, and play your game, boy, and go to sleep. Because you bought, like bro said, you bought the wrong tree. For real, though. <laughs> And people crazy, y'all. Like and like I say, nobody. Please don't take it like bugs. Ungrateful for nothing nobody did to me. But if you it, for me, but if you did it, it supposed to be from the kindness of your heart, not so you can just say, "Hey, I looked out for bugs when he lost his child." You shouldn't even, man. Listen, you shouldn't even spoke upon that shit. And nothing to do with you. None. Like, but you just wanted to be in it. In it. And that you know, and talking about you, you the he ain't talking to nobody, but me, man, stop it. That's I, yeah, when I when I started hearing that, shit, bro, and then we spoke about it, bro, and we confirmed it, bro. I'm like, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, I'm, like, something ain't right about that, you know what I'm saying? That's they, they on some funny, shit. and then, bro, look, like I had to really sit down and explain what was going on to my lady because she, like. What the fuck is she talking about? And she she like first and foremost, like that's straight disrespectful, Wim. Right? Know what I mean? Yeah. She, like straight disrespect. Like you don't say sorry for your yeah. loss or none of that. It's just right. Like, um, like you ain't never talked to this lady before. Like the first thing you do is say, Hi, how you doing? My name is whatever. You know what I'm saying? You introduce yourself. Something. Yeah. You jumped on that motherfucker, bro, and it was so crazy. You said, you ain't got no food. I was like, she like, what the fuck is she talking about? That's <laughs> like, crazy, bro. Like, man, man, get them people that bread back. Fuck. Get them people that bread back. For real, though, bro. Yeah. You shouldn't have put me in there. That's crazy. You gonna put me in something. How about putting that bread back in them people's pockets that you got it from? Mm-hmm. Real talk. You stealing out the collection plate. Hey, she took a handful, huh? Two of them. Yeah. You stealing out the you stealing out the church. The collection plate come around, you pocket and shit. <laughs> and then right. put, and then pulling it out your pocket and taking credit like you gave out. Right. She didn't she put money back in, she took and shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, damn. The yeah, fuck, she... and, and hey bro, and when I came back, why you think? When I came back and I and you give people an update what was going on with me, I was like, look, I don't want nobody to do nothing. Because I was like, shawty, if a motherfucker do something for you, it's always ill intentions. Yeah. Like, it's either they're going to throw it back in your face when you, when you don't agree with what they got going on, they're going to talk shit and throw it in your face. So why, you would rather, bro, I'm telling you this from personal experience, bro, like, if you if I'm ever to get in that situation again, bro, well, I would be quiet, bro, because the backlash you receive from some, uh, you know, small or big, the others, the backlash behind a hundred and forty dollars, bro, and you said and premeditated all this. You wanted this to happen so you can, uh, oh, I'm exposed books because uh, ain't nobody been able to expose them, and. It's the same shit on repeat, bro. People yeah. play it. That's the thing, like, because it's like, why would he say your name in the first place, bro? Like, it wasn't no, like, y'all wasn't beefing, none of that shit, bro. Like, Nothing. You... That's, bro. That's what the fuck confused me, because I'm like, huh? Why, why am I being put in what they got going on? I didn't even, bro, listen. I didn't know nothing about none of that shit you said. Only thing I knew was when... That I did remember somebody joking, saying uh, the predator shit. That's all, I didn't know nothing what was going on with y'all, cause 
I'm watching him and I'm like, damn, he got a problem with gears. And you know, I hear shit, but I'm like, oh, he just talking. Then I'm like, oh, this nigga, hold on. So I'm looking between what's going on with y'all. Like he's talking like, oh, I'm going I'm to throw this shit in Boog's face that I sent them a couple dollars. Like, man, this shit on here, bro, like, it's it just crazy, bro, because if anybody else get in a fucked up situation, like, dog, why is that made fun of? You see what I'm saying? Yeah, bro, and like you said, a, a lot of times, bro, you don't even want to, bro, because that reason, bro. Yeah, and then, like, especially, like I said, people get in fucked up situations by choice. But when shit, you talking about somebody like, bro, just think about that, bro. Like, I can never myself, ever, see myself, somebody lose a child, bro. It's different when you lose. Do you know the feeling, bro? Like, and I ain't gonna get too deep because I don't want to change the conversation to no sorrow shit. But it's different between when you lose your child in the first one or two months. It's the same, but the effects is different than when you saying, my baby do December, uh, December uh, 7th. And the baby died November 30th. Yeah. It's different. Yeah, bro. I, I can't even bro. I can't even imagine that pain, bro. Real talk. I, I said that shit in the lives I was doing back then, bro. I can't imagine how you feeling, bro. Like real talk, bro. But I see that I seen the pain in your face, bro. That last live you did, bro. Anybody who's seen that shit, bro, seen the pain in your eyes, bro. Like you can't even I can't imagine that shit, bro. Real talk. But, but you <laughs> Like I said, bro, at the end of the day, man, you know, they, whatever said, bro, they got to live with that shit. Because either way it go, bro, I ain't do nothing wrong. I didn't, I didn't say, oh, I lost my kid. Can I have some money from y'all? I didn't do that. I came on there and I said, man, look, I share my life with y'all, man. This is one of the worst days of my life. I don't understand, like, why shit keep happening. Because for those that don't know, I lost my brother in May. I lost one of my close friends Thanksgiving morning. Then I lost my child November 30th. And at the time, workers comp took my money that was owed to me. And I had to go through court, a court process and all that to reach a settlement. But that was the toughest fucking time I ever been through my life, dog. And you people couldn't think about nothing else to do. But, oh, let me uh, find some shit. That's all you can say is he was, oh, workers comp took his shit. He ain't, shit was fucked up. He was on YouTube uh, making a way for his family. That's all you can say. You can't play me. <laughs> know what I mean? And, it, and like I said, I appreciate everybody that did anything for me and my family, reached out by email, uh, that uh, put a video up for me, even the people that you know, was back and forth with me. I appreciated that shit, bro. And I told you that. That don't mean, you know, like, that don't mean I'm going to fuck with him, but I, it's a respect. Like, appreciate that. You know what I mean? But all this old, this old shit, man, and, like, people don't even think, man, like, I ain't going to, certain shit I can't do. I ain't going to talk about this person losing their kid because I sent them a few dollars. But I'm definitely not going to talk about the rest of the money that posted been there. I'm gonna keep that, but I'm gonna talk about what I what I did do. When you yeah. should have just stayed quiet about it, not saying nothing about books, and then you start disrespecting people that had my back through it all, that never changed on me, that not just YouTube comments that was calling me, not worrying about when you coming back to YouTube. That was like, how you how how your family doing, books? You gotta stay strong for them, books. But like I can say I'm a, I'm gonna deflect that conversation and get off that, bro, because I don't want fuck up the, 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 the live, but bro, man, I don't know, man, people weird as shit, bro, and it's just, it's just, you know, if you don't agree with what they say, bro, Dennis, let me talk shit about you, man, you can't paint me in no bad light, because guess what, whether it's one person or 90 people or a thousand, ten thousand people, I'm gonna still be bugs, one thing you can't say is that I changed, period, I'm still bugs, right, and I, I thought they would have learned by now, bro. You told them, you told them way back when that shit happened, bro. Like, I can't be exposed, bro. Like, At I'm, all. I'm, and guess still, what, bro? Still, <laughs> guess what, my nigga? Have, has Boogs been exposed? 
Nah. Undefeated. All y'all said was, oh, boobs big. And then you turn around and the same people on your smoking weed said, I can't take care of my kids. Help me. And I still said, I'm going to say a prayer for them. I told my girl, I said, this the nigga that was talking crazy about me. Now look at this. What? Look at the irony of this shit. Now you begging people to help you with your kids, but you can, you got a blunt in your mouth. But I'm right. still, I told my girl, I said, I'm still going to pray. What's up, TG? I'm still going to pray, man. Now I mean? Because at the end of the day, what I went through, bro, it won't allow me to hate none of these people, even this clown JJ. It well, is honey, what it is, bro. Like, you got to deal with that. Like, you got to deal with that, nigga. I ain't come on here to ask for no sympathy, nigga. I ain't asked nobody. When I asked, I asked people. I didn't, um, I ain't try to, hey, I got to do this move, but I need this, and then I'm going to come back like this. No. Motherfucker, I flat out saying, look, man, the work can't be playing with me, man. I'm not trying to be, have to be forced back to the streets. If you can help, help. That's how I did it. I didn't beg y'all. I asked. And guess what? If I look in my motherfucking chat or I watch somebody else live and they going through something, I'm going to help them. But I ain't going to get up that bitch no month later and talk crap about them, sneak diss them, or tell nobody else what the fuck I did for them because they had a bad situation. Exactly. This shit clown, nah. clown shit for real. Yeah, talking about clowns, man. Do y'all know what clown is? Because the shit y'all doing is the example <laughs> of clown shit. For real though, bro. And, and, bro, look, one more thing before I finish. When all that shit was going on and people was like, leave it alone, such and such. Leave, leave, this, leave this alone, man. Y'all need to let them, let Straight Drop do him and you do him. Uh, it was certain people. They kept sending messages. They kept trying to, hey, bro, goddamn, them niggas said this. They was keep trying to do that. But it's the same people that's pointing these fingers. Y'all was trying to keep niggas in the middle of that. A lot of y'all. But y'all got uh -huh. a nerd to go live and call yourself calling somebody out. Man, come That's on. Great, man. <laughs> this That's shit a joke, bro. Yeah, bro. Like it's, it, it, it's, this shit just a joke, my nigga. It ain't even like, like not even being funny, dog. Like, like niggas weird, man. Like, I don't, Ooh, give a fuck, bro. I don't care cool. what live you do, how crazy you talk, how disrespectful you get. At the end of the day, it is what it is. You played yourself. And bugs is bugs, and I'm never gonna change. I ain't gonna try. I don't care what if anybody ever send you anything. Make sure that they know that hey, that you can't buy me. Mm -hmm. I ain't gonna agree with everything you say. Some shit you say I might. If it's real, it's real. But don't think because um you did this that is ready to be like oh uh yeah I gotta agree with everything they say. They right. No, nah, it don't work like that. Nah, not at all. It straight can't. up. It don't, it don't work like that, bro. If you ain't know now, you know. Shit. Yeah, straight up, bro. It don't it don't work like that. And I don't care nothing about nobody. You know, I don't care about them whack ass videos and clown ass jokes you gonna say and trying to be like somebody else. I don't care nothing about that, man. You played yourself. Yeah. <laughs> Simple as that, bro. Real talk. But I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna uh play the rest of this video uh yeah i'm gonna go ahead and jump in the shower bro I, um i i i shoot you a message when i finish the shit much love to all y'all anybody i ain't speak to i much love to y'all peace and blessings man and i wish everybody the best all right for sure appreciate you uh coming through bro already bro all right y'all i'm finna i'm finna play the rest of this video so y'all can just see some of the more more of the clown shit this nigga was saying man for real like like we said, he played himself, bro. But let's see if he gonna try to continue this shit. Real fool, make your money though, bro. Make your motherfucking money, bro. Cause you should have typed this shit in there, bro. And then you over there with that fuck shit, bro. So fuck you, bro. Like the fuck I said, nigga. He no, emotional. Fuck with grown ass men, though, real man. Come decapitate your motherfucking ass, bitch ass, y'all nigga. Bro, did you say you was gonna come decapitate me, bro? <laughs> this nigga crazy, bro. You was emotional as hell, bro. He said I'ma decapitate him, boy. You must not seen that one live I did, boy. I ain't, I ain't worried about shit, nigga. You better ask Joe Chin, nigga. Real, bro. And when you 
call, bitch. Don't call for my wife, cause my wife ain't saying shit to your whole head, bro. But the type of nigga like you is, you gonna throw that shit in there because you already been jugging at my wife. Right, like you been uh trying to throw shots at women and shit because they got an opinion on you. Like, bro, what y'all think? Cause y'all y'all paint yourself with these uh giving Christians and shit that ain't nobody gonna not like you, bro. I don't know what the fuck going on with this nigga. You see, cause you can't answer me like a motherfucking man or hit my motherfucking phone number. Yeah, nigga. Cause I tried to contact you, bro. Go back and look at your Gmail, bro. Cause I Yeah, bro, I seen it, bro. We ain't got shit to talk about, bro. I you ain't never give me on um, your real number. I gave you mine. That's why 100 I am, bro. And you can try to mind drop all the screenshots and shit. We want to talk about shit, girl. What what you talking about dropping screenshots for? That's the type of shit y'all do, bro. What what I'm have to drop a screenshot for? Nigga, you you trying to make it seem like I started beefing with you, bro. That's what you trying to do. Yeah. You must forget, bro. Yeah. Now, who the next motherfucker? Then on top of that to add clarification of what the fuck I was saying, she C Lad was just cursing my Jahara slap ass out, bro. Real shit. So we know that bitch on her message, bro. I told y'all my Right. He he can call Jahara out, out her name. But when it comes to his wife, you you can't even you can't even make a joke towards yourself. Nigga, you a clown, bro. Real talk, bro. The comment says it's gonna get y'all fucked off in the lab chat, bro. So fuck the dumb shit, bro. I can go in and chat. I want you. Yeah, bitch, but you been not say shit about us, bro. You been not type of motherfucking mumbling emoji or shit, bro. For real, for enough facts, for real, man. Playing and shit, man. Like nigga, like. South member, ho. I read on her, bro. Laughing at them cat ass, weak ass joke, bro. Then I don't even get. People don't care about the truth, man. That real shit. Then what I don't get is he over there seeing this shit. I'm knowing they being our bushes might be still with that fuck shit, man. Still with that fuck shit, bro. I mean, you don't get no pass, bro. Tamika Zimmerman, Jahara Rodriguez, Gears O'Malley. What the fuck his name is? For um um Mika Me. What a hard concrete chin having age. Shout Man, out, who else? Shout I out. hit myself, aka T Harrison. Shout out to Mika Me. You see, you see, he tried to name off everybody. I told y'all he be in them bushes just mad as hell. He be over there punching walls and shit. Bro, what's wrong with <laughs> let me run it back? Dog mad as a bitch. Mine, who else? I ain't met myself, aka T Harrison. Off of Channel 10 looking at his mind. The list goes on and on, y'all. They don't blast on all these bitches. See what I'm saying, bro? He he act like he he gonna stop everybody from saying anything about his wife, bro. Bro, you you gonna <laughs> you tripping, boy? Michael, they got him fucked up, bro. For real. For real. All them get that excuse, as y'all can see. Well they, well, they said they called me predator. Um, so I um 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 it was it was straight drop people. Man, fuck that, bro. Fuck that, bro. Girls, you were just on a panel with clown being there, bro. Was Facts, nigga. And that motherfucker was lit, nigga. I'm mad I had to uh step away for like damn near an hour. But yeah, nigga, I was on the panel with them, nigga. That motherfucker was lit. Shout out NTP, nigga. Shout out everybody who was on that panel, nigga. What the fuck is you talking about? He's up there with that fuck shit, bro. Real shit. <laughs> hey, Tiffany, he ain't catch you, huh? <laughs> and then the question is, girls, where the fuck did you come from, bro? He, he said, where the fuck did I come from? For real, for you. Where you, where you come from? The other side of the Conch community? Where? He said, where I come from? The other side of the Conch community? <laughs> Other side of Crunch community, <laughs> bro. I've been here. I ain't stick around for this whole little tenure on this motherfucker. 
just going back and forth and shit. But nigga, I've been here from the get go. Nigga, check my pages. Nigga, I used to drop videos and all. Yeah, I've been here. I've been here. Why you worried about where I come from, bro? You were just. Never mind. Where the fuck you come from, bro? Like, serious, fool. Some dirt ass dreads in your motherfucking head. Where the fuck you come from? Plenty of the new growth. Yeah, plenty new growth. I'm glad you noticed. Plenty new growth. For real, fool. You the Uber driver now, Buckwheat Junior, ugly ass nigga. I, I'm I'm the so-called Uber driver, but you couldn't even your your truck was broke down. You couldn't even get to Walmart, bro. You you was calling me trying to borrow the scooter and shit. I want pick up, nigga. That's why you mad, nigga. <laughs> nigga was trying to borrow the scooter. I want pick up. <laughs> My bad, Real, bro. bro. What's good, Amore? My bad. I had to change the live and shit. I saw you come, uh, came through on the other one. You set the reminder, but I had to start up another one because it wouldn't let me. I had I had scheduled the live at work, and uh, we ain't got Hangouts at work. Well, I ain't download Hangouts because you know I ain't gonna be going live on the computer from work. But yeah, I had scheduled it so motherfuckers can know that uh, JJ was finna get this work. Hey, Cherry. Yup, you already know that's. That's why I ain't pick up for his ass. Like, hell no, nah, bro. Hell no, nah, nigga. This generated ass, man. Dollar, dollar, dollar store meat ass. Beat y'all got around here. From Peaceville. Pick this shit, y'all. Mara said, man. Hey, mugshot. <laughs> you might as well do whatever you're going to do now because he about to say it. Um, Chris, I was safe at first in the first part of the lab, but he come back around. Man, Chris, I'll dock some people too in this day and the third. Duh, motherfucker, we been saying it. But the whole time he's time on tank screaming, get faith, get faith too, get her. My Mary, fuck you, bro. Suck my dog dick, bro. Real talk, folks. See, hey, shout out to uh the, the troll that used to come around. <laughs> JJ uh no neck or something like that. JJ no name or no neck, one of the two. That's I get why that motherfucker was made, bro. Like Bro, you a man, bro. Don't be telling other men to do that shit, bro. That, you know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, you know, it's just... I'm, I'm going to continue. Sh hey, shout hey, out, my Maxwell. Still, bro. First lady YouTube, too, bro. Ain't nobody calling for you and checking for you, bitch. Real talk. Y'all, your imaginary ass husband ain't calling or checking for your ass, dumb ass hoe. And you said that you changed your phone number, bitch, and you were falling back from YouTube. Now, all of a sudden, it went from there to you getting phone calls, phone number, open phone line number. Get the fuck out of here with this shit, bitch. How bad is not checking for your raggedy ass, man? Come the fuck on, bro. Now, if Cena would have never said this shit, your bitch ass would never say this shit. So, I guess motherfuckers might own um, calling people and hanging up or coming back somebody. Hey, baby mama, I think you was good. I think you good on this one. I don't think he meant to you. <laughs> I have two two strange men, so there's trend in it. Two strange men show up in my house, and somebody calling me in, a, in the early morning, hang it up. And now this mission, y'all. He got. Hey, didn't they already get exposed as liars, anti? You know what I'm saying? Like, come on. A, a Spanish accent, and he's speaking Ebonics and telling me, "Ho, bitch, what the fuck, man? Get the fuck out of here, man!" Last later, you two. For real, for you, you the now nah, you the first lady. Uh, you the first lady of Whoville, bitch. Dumb motherfucker. I'm trying like, to skip ahead to my comments. I don't want to hear all these dumb, dumb shit he's talking. Dumb. Girls, you see, right up oh, hold on. Same shit, bro. I'ma drop every seat like fuckers. He said, "Dumb motherfuckers, dumb." Girls, you said that same shit, bro. I'ma drop every seat like that, bro. What receipt? Oh bro? yeah. <laughs> you left this shit right up on a piece of me video, bro. Yeah, bro. I be dropping comments. What the fuck you talking about, nigga? Yeah. What you think, nigga? I'm my own man, nigga. I don't answer to you, nigga. That's not my wife, nigga. The hell wrong with you? Yeah, them motherfuckers don't. 
with them motherfuckers that were dogs in the video you were talking about, bitch. And it's me and my motherfucking wife. Gears. No one for your ass, fool. Bro, didn't I tell you, bro? I don't know what type of receipts you think you got, bro. I stand by what I said, bro. Show scrubbing down bullshit, man. I have never seen a bunch of grown or proclaimed to be grown motherfuckers a day in my goddamn life. Man, when I used to stay, my motherfucking mom's out like 13, my nigga. I first, when I first started getting kicked out the motherfucking house, I'm gonna listen, bro. I always had my own, bro. She was running around, bro. This thing with no, with no me, bro. Motherfucker, nothing was he doing so with him. And this, we won't do no stand with no mom, bro. You can fuck at least a whole day out of life. With some kind of boy, my mess, my, my dad pulled his mess out with him. What? Brother, he won't talk to damn. Oh, and then, hold on, bro. Hold up. This nigga got the bragging. Because I told y'all he over there dick riding world news now. Uh, he over there bragging about how World News got an interview with Nature Boy, bro. So I hopped up in the chat, bro. I said, Nature Boy, tell everybody to call in. Laughing emojis. Next comment. I said, anybody can. <laughs> Hold on, let me go back. Hold on. This nigga, this nigga was talking about he can sell this nigga was saying that world news can go sell his his interview to bet uh cnn i'm gonna let y'all hear for y'all so the fuck wrong with you but then he had to adapt enough to hate on world news because he did an interview with nature boy and guess what y'all nobody on this side of youtube or nobody i fucking know period bro can pull could have had pulled that interview out nature boy is the nigga uh who everybody be uh streaming on, on instagram live you know what i'm saying he live uh in mexico uh he so-called lives by nature but you know what i'm saying uh they obviously uh connected with everybody with a lot of fucking technology and shit and you know yeah nature boy he just he 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 one of them conscious niggas you know what i'm saying and he just he he, he controversial Controversial is is a motherfucker, uh, basically. <laughs> With some kind of way, my mess, my my dad pulled his magic off and got this pool on this side. Let me let me start news. it back. He did an interview with Nature. The fuck around with you, but then he had to adapt enough to hate on world news because he did an interview with Nature Boy. He said, "Whoever had the audacity to uh, hate on world news because he pulled off an inter interview with Nature Boy." And guess what, y'all? Nobody on this side of YouTube, or nobody I fucking know, period, bro, can pull, could have had pulled that interview out with some kind of. He said he don't know nobody on this side of YouTube that could have pulled that interview off. Wait, my man. Hold on, real quick, my dog. Barking. He said his guy pulled off his magic to get this motherfucker to talk to him. Don't tell all no mind at work and go say that motherfucking interview mind to BET, TMZ, entertainment tonight. He said, Don't y'all know that world can go off and, and sell this interview to BET, uh, TMZ, uh, Entertainment tonight. All different kind of mind news station, bro, because they are intrigued by Nature Boy. You see what I'm saying, bro? Listen, nigga, ain't nobody, nigga. Have you ever seen anybody in here ever seen Nature Boy on BET, TMZ, or Entertainment Tonight? Because you know how many people been fucking caught. The nigga, you can call in and interview this nigga, bro. If you want to call it an interview. <laughs> All right, MC, much love. <laughs> Bruh, 
right cherry then i'm like bro this nigga whole his whole interview was about chinese bro like what the fuck? that nigga reminiscing about the 11th flow what the fuck? <laughs> this nigga having flashbacks he was reminiscing the whole time during the interview and he won't even talk to them motherfuckers, bro. In other words, y'all remember Dan Rapper? He won't talk to Dan Rapper, but he'll come all the way to the hood and talk to Word News. Come on, on there. <laughs> that's special, y'all. That's special, y'all. That's what he was talking about when he said nobody ain't screaming out the real shit, but y'all hoes hosting on Integrator, Integrator. You know what I'm saying? Panda, that's what the fuck he was talking about. That's what my brother was elaborating on, bro. But y'all didn't want to hear this shit. Y'all didn't want to listen to it. Y'all just want to think he bragging and shit. It's mad with this bitch age. And yeah, why matter? You saying something about nature before, bro? You don't even know him. I don't even know. All right, him. thank you, baby mama, because we what? definitely need some uh, clarification. Word on he talked the word. So what's your problem with that? You hateful, miserable motherfucker. So you going a little too hard, man, for this weed, bitch, bro. See, he talking about mine. Like, I don't yeah, like that. You, you keep forcing it, bro, with all that extra shit. Yeah, I will have you get here, there. Fuck you, my man. But guess what? I can talk about them kids, y'all. Guess what? Them ain't even this real. Oh, I forgot. The nigga was talking about kids and everything, y'all. Shout out to the church. Shout out to the church. The nigga was talking about kids and everything, bro. Talking about, he was calling kids retarded, bro. All type of shit. I, I think he said uh modern kids ain't gonna be shit because he wasn't shit. Fuck your retired ass kids, bitch. Oh, you to talk about your family, bro. Hey, guess what, man? Fuck your retired ass kids, bitch. Since you're talking about my wife, your kids were a waste of nut, bro. But guess what? I can talk about them kids, y'all. Guess what? Them ain't even his real kids, y'all. He said I can talk about the kids, y'all, because I'm a Christian. Cause I'm a Christian and I'm a repent later on. So we all good. A married type of nigga here just saying a motherfucking birth certificate, bro. And them thanks for won't tell I know that ain't the kid. They don't look shit like them. Ain't... But but did y'all hear the excuse that 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 the that the the microwave Christian uh gave though? He said I can talk about the kids because they ain't his. Nigga, what? What? Oh shit, peace Smith. We got the 13 mini microwave Christians. <laughs> I never seen the motherfucking baby mommy, bro. Real talk. Ask them to pull up my MD, get a DNA, DNA test on the bastards. Ask them. And guess what? We know my mind sick and got drunk disease and shit. Why his kids ain't shaking? Don't them, them children be trying to get the fuck away from bro ass. Those that shit. Nah, you got fucking nigga about. I'm trying to get on to where he blocked me. And, and, and shout out to my nigga King King Bit for blocking me earlier, bro. That's what's up, bro. <laughs> Ain't no hard feelings, bro. Like real talk. Ain't no hard feelings, bro. I know you fuck with JJ. You fuck with me. You fuck with a lot of people, bro. You abide in this chat, bro. He want to be gone, bro. You did your job, bro. Shout out to King Bit. <laughs> Five to seven videos, man. Before I, I still fuck with really you, bro. I still pull up some crime royal with you. You feel me? Real talk. Now holding this lady, man. Seriously, anybody that was over there at that time period, up until when I when she told me and my wife to eat her pussy, bro. This is my wife. Let me do it. Sick of you, bitches, man. Like for real, fool. Yeah, where am I? We and her gonna fuck this whole thing up, bro. For real, fool. Cause I'm sick of they they idolize you too like that. We finna snatch this shit from you bitches, man. Make this shit go a whole nother way. But for real, drop a real. Hey, Super facts, Bowl, little man. DC. Kim, you only got that. Fuck all this shit up, and then you will see what the fuck we been talking about, people. Hey, be like y'all y'all been y'all been idolizing YouTube a little bit too much. Yeah, from the real life. Uh huh. Soon this motherfucker go live, man. The same group of nasty, disgust, deep. The fuck up. Yeah, I don't know what he was talking about, uh, Auntie. I don't know. All right. Who else? Who else? I'm trying First to later YouTube. I'm trying to skip forward to when he he started going crazy and blocking. You no, know I'm saying real talk. I don't know when the fuck that was. I'm like, what the fuck? And then ain't the cover. Thank you for coming over. Hey, 
I saw your ass to see the chat too, bro. Where Miss Coleman at? She was just here, right? Delete the chat. Over there with that fuck shit again, bro. He mad at you. Guess what? I ain't even got nothing to say to you, bro. See the go. Hey, 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 Mika. <laughs> Mika, it's crazy because it was a troll in the chat that was like, how you talking about somebody? Because he was talking about somebody being a snitch. I'm like, bro, how you talking about somebody being a snitch when y'all just said y'all was going to get Myron locked up? <laughs> Come on now. I'm like, shit, some of the trolls be on point. Don't dress your ass, fool, because you know damn well. Some of them just be a, uh, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> trolling. That's your party, fool. You talking about somebody who, so who is Seeley? Man, you know who the fuck Seeley is, bro. Get the fuck out of here with this shit, and I got the screenshot on there, too, man. Fuck out of here. Hey, Seeley, bro. 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 Hey, You'll be all right. JJ, he didn't he called you out. <laughs> Got no pride with you, sister girl. But but the way our conversation went the other day, me, you and my wife, you was over here saying that you understand what the fuck Monica has done, but you, honey like, would like me and my wife to step down or just don't say Hey, uh Bam, Celia is uh Monica. Monica Mo Justice, which I I don't know I don't I don't get why they call her silly. <laughs> Somebody said that his wife looked more like silly, and I uh I can't help but agree. You know what I'm saying? Anything. Just just don't say. You know the the, the best response is no response. We telling you we respect you, honey, like, but also mind you, we don't we always respond, honey, like. Want me to tell you how you know that, honey, like? Because your ass is over there with Cedar last night, too. And I got the screenshots of that. Not only were you over there with Monica, man, I get it. I understand y'all coming to the end. Even though she do fuck shit, you still gonna ride with it. And you gonna have her back. I respect you for that, baby girl. So please don't take this out of content. Now, lining up what Cedar was saying to what the chat was saying, to what you typed in there, honey, like, she was talking about me and my wife again. One of the things she was like, um, Faith got the motherfucking dress. Um, she's the ma ma main manipulator. Can I get an A, man? And here you go. <laughs> you and um, in loving me, whatever that whole name is, in loving me. Amen from her. And here you go. Famous honey, like, it just got off the phone. Off, off the phone, me and my wife. This is 72 hours ago. Amen. When Monica was talking about me and my wife and this day and the third really going in, honey, like, you was agreeing with her. I saw that, baby girl. All right, we going to skip forward. Can't say mine. Oh, I think he got mad because I, I came in the chat and I put takeover. <laughs> That's when I think he started going in on me again. So I'm going to try to find where I dropped that comment. I was like, takeover. <laughs> Oh, oh, that if you caught that last part, NTP, when he said glue sniffing, he called himself, uh, I think he was trying to talk about your husband. So, right, it, it's cool for him to talk about your husband, but uh, you can't talk about his wife. <laughs> That was John Howay is going back over there to die for y'all. Yeah, yeah, he, he was. Keep on fucking with my brother. Now I ain't tired of me. Tired of her. Let all you bitch. We motherfucking exposed now. All this fuck shit on the counter. Hey, Logic, I heard your ass too, bro. Hey, I already knew my that was that was your own. Um, that your number was out, bro. Well, I'm telling you how I knew, cause I called your ass the other day personally, bro. And I had to text you, bro. You see what I'm saying? And I let the person know, man. You know what I'm saying? That the female who, who hey, facts, was out, bro. You see what facts. I'm saying? It's like for real, like. But Brooke called you for just like he called Mary always, man. <clears throat> and Mary day, man, didn't help. But Mary, he answered the phone, bro. All right, come on, come on. I heard your voice. 
Then he sat there and said, ah, I love this shit. Ah, y'all weird. We weird, bro. You love this shit. I, and, uh, uh, I, I can't hear y'all. I, I can't hear y'all. <laughs> the fuck out of here, bro. Cab that ain't nigga. And it's over the internet, bro. I right, come on, bro. Come on. Time, I don't want to be up bro. You first got Man, who gives a fuck, bro? You told me. And 50, now 60 other motherfuckers that was in here at the time, 61, I cracked the cup. Yeah, long. Oh, there it go. I just... real, man. Where the fuck you want to be? Oh, there, shit. Man? I just dropped a comment, y'all. You about to go real, nuts. bro. Fuck this shit, folks. <laughs> All this YouTube shit, bro. Fuck this shit, bro. Where your bitch ass want to meet up at, nigga? Hold on. I'm finna screen share this shit so y'all don't think I'm bullshitting. I'll be dead serious. Let me see. Oh, see that? Yes. Oh, see that? I'll be fine. See my I'm tech not man child. This nigga the motherfucking problem, man. I'm, I'm gonna be his motherfucking problem child, man. He man piece of milk. Like for real, fool. He still bring your way, bring your way to the dirty south, man. And see my wife, see if they don't mind wipe your way, my real motherfucking talk. Don't let you kiss the fly. Cause cause that's what Jesus would do. <laughs> that's what Jesus would do. Like <laughs> me, bitch, you fine. John ain't gonna let you out the house, huh? He gonna keep your ass, your fat ass locked up in the back of the house. In that little room in, in, in the front of the house with that purple ass lamp. You match your fucking eyebrows, bitch. Y'all don't be listening to my crackhead in the back. You talking this shit, nigga, you not have no motherfucking hands, bro. You motherfucker wigging. <laughs> Tamika Zimmer. I'm sick of your fat ass, too, man. Hey, I gave you a shout out to Tamika. He tried to dish you. I put it right in the chat. Shout out to Mika. Oh, my mama. mama. Another purpose step of a grown, lonely motherfucker. Fat ass bitch. It's fat as a motherfucker, man. I'm talking about like she's fat for no fucking reason, bro. You fat on your sale, bitch. Yeah, yeah, we will. Like, we don't hear real, that shit. Boy, you sloppy on you. Come on, what you bitch, because they know your fat ass bad thing, yo. For real, that what type of hoe you here, man. Real shit. Takeover. Oh, he caught it now. So, that, 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 so that, 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 that what you do? <laughs> that what you do, girl? Come on, where is it? Do immature ass shit like that? That nigga, that over. nigga hit a straight drop right there. Y'all hear that? Hold up, let me run it back. Takeover. So, that, 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 so that, 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 that what you do? So, that, 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 so that, 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 that what you do? So. So, get, 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 so, they'll, 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 they'
bro this is clown shit, bro how am i supposed to take it bro this is some clown shit, bro i'm laughing at this shit, bro i'm literally over there at work bro they like i know they looking like bro what is this nigga over there chuckling and shit at bro <laughs> shout out to tamika they what you do good come over here and just do immature and shit like that shout out to tamika yeah nigga, you already know shout out to tamika nigga. the fuck you talking about nigga? That's Myron's. That's that's my remain piece right there, nigga. Is you tripping, nigga? Shout man, shout out my Maxwell. Shout out to Mika Zimmerman. Shout out to these niggas, girls, and your motherfucking mama mouth, bitch ass niggas. Bruh, I didn't. Bruh, I swear to God, I didn't catch this nigga saying that, bruh. I swear to God, I ain't hear this nigga say that shit, bruh. I swear to God, I ain't hear this nigga say that shit, bruh. I, Bro, I ought to smack this shit out so loose neck ass dog. What the fuck wrong with you? Fuck away, shout out to these nuts, girls, and your motherfucking mama mouth, bitch ass niggas. Fuck away, mother of mine. Hey, that's that's some, some Christian shit for you, y'all. Straight Christian shit, straight out the microwave, nigga. King Big, take that nigga ass out, man. That, that's when my nigga King Big took me out, you know what I'm saying. It take a real nigga to shoot your guy, you feel me? That's cool though. That's how I know King bit a real one, you feel me? <laughs> That's how I know King bit a real one. It take a real nigga to shoot your guy. Look at ass nigga. <laughs> Shout out King bit. Like I said, ain't no hard feelings towards you, my guy. Real talk. Real talk, man. Yeah, that's when he got me up out of there. <laughs> Appreciate that, homie. Yeah, it ain't no time in that either, man. Hey, just get rid of this whole way, nigga, man. Hey, hey, what's up, Queen Queen Catherine? Hey, ain't you the same one mind that was on the phone with um, with um, with, um, what, with the leaf ass? Well, he was trying to come for everybody. <laughs> Duh. I'm Queen Catherine. I'm waiting. What's up? What's up with me, Doug? Last year, yes. Our last last year. Cause it might be funny, man. We got to talk this shit on her, man. You know her ass lying too. Really, lady, you ain't come around to verify none of this shit, but you got all this other extra ass shit to say. And I mean it. Hey, I'm surprised my comments still uh pop up. I thought usually when they block you in the chat that on the replay your comments on uh pop up. Yeah, you want to know today? It's a white drop, though. Now I ain't saying to see my having over here trying to say this. This was so before Thanksgiving. <laughs> Everybody, for real, bro. If you're rolling, you're rolling, man. You're rolling with the truth, roll with the truth, bro. Fuck it. I ain't gonna like it. I ain't gonna like it anyway. Get what? Because you probably already didn't like my ass anyway. Oh, they didn't so, hide me. For okay. real, bro. I guess yeah, y'all hey, might want to not tell him that because he said shit. We don't time people out. He said we are people. I think that's what he said. Who like who and who really cool with who and we really didn't give a fuck all the time. <laughs> hey, for real. Oh, hey, for like, real. Elder like anybody that's up here. So see that line started my five blocks my two weeks. <laughs> Oh, you already yeah, caught line saying it. that, bro. We already got a video Check that me, disproves you that. What the hell wrong with me? All right, man. That's basically the end of uh uh. Shit, I don't know what to call it. Shit. The beginning of the end of uh of JJ. And unfortunately his wife might go down with him. Shit. And nigga should learn she when she not with him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I forgot I had it on screen share. Low key. Y'all call, call, <laughs> caught the bobblehead. <laughs> Y'all got the bubble. <laughs> I forgot I had why, this shit on screen. Why not just say, 
Bro, we don't even want an apology from your bitch head, bro. Yeah, yeah, society, society, no doubt, no doubt. Shout out to Jesus for making this possible. Uh, yeah. Just remember before you do anything, you know, what would Jesus do? Just don't say this shit no more, but you ain't gonna do it, fool. So I'm gonna put her, and I'm gonna tell you why, fool. Because it like you 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 sitting there telling me, nigga. Fuck <laughs> you, bro. A you know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, you telling me this. So it like you put hands on me, bro. I feel like you wanna fight me, bro. Like in real life, fool. You, you should be wanting to fight world, yeah, but you know, that's cool. You ran your crazy <laughs> ass up here with that bullshit, bro. Yo, the fuck you got, bro? So they ain't so fucking funny to you. Bro. Oh, okay. He was back on me. Hold on, hold on. Caught him at the end. <laughs> yeah, what's up, bro? Man, I get your way, man. Be you talk, fool. Yeah, bro. You had my motherfucking phone number, nigga. Since you ran your crazy ass up here with that bullshit, bro. Bruh, he said I ran in there on that bullshit, but did the nigga not mention me for me to pop out? Did he not mention me for me to pop out? So who was with that bullshit? Like I said, bro, you 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 you, you fucked yourself over, bro. I don't know what the fuck you was thinking, my nigga. Yo, the fuck you got, bro? So everything so fucking funny, you bro. Immature ass nigga. This shit was definitely funny. So, bro, what the fuck you want to do, Amram, bro? Fuck piecemeal, eat a dick steal, T Harrison, fuck you, ho. Tamika Zerman, double make fuck you, ho. Mika me, fuck you too, ho. What's your <laughs> man looking at you? Shout out everybody. First lady of YouTube of Whoville, fuck you too. Never fall saying ass, ho. <laughs> Mika. <laughs> Fuck all y'all, bro. Real shit, fool. Right, right. Anybody else who over there? Exactly, Tamika. You the one immature. What the fuck? I immature and the amateur. I got you, Tamika. I can even say, <laughs> Ryan, with that bullshit. Fuck you, too. I ain't even nobody out, man. I didn't even know the backstory to it. Oh, you should have touched it. <laughs> MVP, you a fool. <laughs> Get the job. So, everybody mind all that fuck shit, man. Mine. Fuck y'all, too, bro. Get up at these bitch, man. Bro, you Who's really. Y'all coming through, man. Bro. Nigga, you really, you really. Put yourself into some mess, bro. Cause like I said before, bro, when 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 Bugs was on here, bro, we we been knew about this shit, bro. Wasn't nobody finna say shit, bro. But you took it to that level, bro. For what reason? For what reason, bro? Cause you all over there, mad as hell in your emotions, chat watching this shit, bro. Like then I used to talk about this this chat watching shit with them other motherfuckers. How they used to be chat watching and shit, all in their feelings. This this the same shit, man. It's the same shit. This shit is sad. This shit is sad. But like I said, y'all, I'm looking forward to seeing what's gonna come next. Cause like I, the, the nigga shit, he should basically don't say nothing after this, bro. Ain't nothing to be said, bro. You you took it you took it somewhere you shouldn't have, bro. He was talking about exposing the whole camp. Uh, what camp? Uh, what you was talking about exposing our leader? What leader? You know what I'm saying? What's good, Huggy? What's going on? Uh, hey, real talk, Myra. Need to step up her. <laughs> uh, shit. Yeah, y'all already know. All this shit is society fault. Uh, if you didn't know, now you know. Uh, society. If you would have just did the right thing. You know what I'm saying? Now you got everybody else dragged into your bullshit as always. It's your fault. The fuck? <laughs> but yeah, bro, I don't even know why this nigga even took it to this level, bro. Like, I didn't even say shit to y'all, bro. Ain't say, sh ain't say shit about y'all. <laughs> 
None of that shit, bro. Talking about exposing a leader. All type of shit, bro. Like, why did you even? I don't get it, bro. I don't get it. Maybe he can clear this shit up later on. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe he can. I'm hoping. Because the nigga still lost. <laughs> Say it <laughs> Who was the goddamn leader? Society. He already pulled the mask off. He he said it was bugs. He said bugs was pulling strings while he was gone. He said bugs was pulling strings. <laughs> he said, nigga. He said, I'm gonna expose your fearless leader. Like, well, nigga, who is the leader, bro? <laughs> Oh shit. Oh my my bad society, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> my bad society, you know what I'm saying? I'm just saying if you would have did the right thing, you know what I'm saying, I wouldn't even be on this live right now. <laughs> I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying? It's it's nothing uh in, in my uh in my Margo voice. It's nothing we can't grow from. You know what I'm saying? It's nothing we can't get past. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta learn how to do the right thing. You know what I'm saying? Make better choices. <laughs> Where that bread at? Oh. <laughs> oh, hindsight. Get your ass up out of here, dog. Ain't you been up in here for a while? You tripping, bro? The fuck? Like I said, like like I said earlier, society. If you want to laugh at a joke, it's a joke. If they want to be mad because you cool with them and you laughed at a joke, man, they gonna have to get over that shit. But I ain't, you know what I'm saying? It's cool that you you kept it real with they ass, but even if you was laughing at some some a joke that was said about his wife, man, get over that shit, bro. You out here calling all type of women, uh, all type of names, bro. But you, you sentencing somebody to death over a joke. Come on, man. Man, what the hell? <laughs> all right, society, don't take all day now. Don't take all day now. <laughs> Right, cherry, right now. Laughter get dictated in the streets. That's why I'm like, bro, I'm gonna continue to laugh at your ass, bro. I'm gonna continue, bro. Because this some clown shit. Like, nigga, do you even listen to yourself? Like, I don't know if a lot of people do this, but the people who do lives and videos or whatever, but do y'all go back and 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 watch yourself, listen to yourself? You know what I'm saying? If JJ, if you don't, you might want to start, bro. Just chill out, bro. What would Jesus do? <laughs> Where that bread, nigga? Where that bread and, and and send a motherfucking bottle of wine with it, nigga? Just for the hard for for the troubles, nigga. My nigga, uh, Huggy, where you at? I know you sip wine. W what's some good wine, man? I'm just playing. I ain't getting. <laughs> he might be mad at you if you actually answer that question. You know what I'm saying? And you ain't got shit to do with shit. You just walked in, but. Let me don't even huggy. Don't answer that shit. Uh I'm just get some um some Chardonnay or some shit or uh I don't know. <laughs> Let me relax. How dare anybody laugh in this itty bitty good <laughs> right news tubers? What the hell? What the hell wrong with us? Anybody, anybody with laugh emojis in the chat right now, you gotta go. You got to go. Society, you lucky you got a wrench. I, I'm thinking about taking it. Mug shot up. Oh, you gone. Tiff for tat. I'm taking your wrench. You gone. Society, damn. Uh, again, society again. Oh, damn. Cherry, I didn't want to do it to you, but you got to go. Mug shot, you didn't got to go. Tamika, got to go. Uh, shout out to you, though. I ain't, I ain't taking I ain't taking back my shout out or nothing, uh, but you got to go. We, we don't do no laughing out here. I think everybody else good. Oh, okay, you slipped up. Tanya, you slipped up. 
Y'all got to go. <laughs> Cabernet, that sounds like some uh, expensive shit. I don't know. <laughs> Look at all y'all think I'm playing. Look, P. Smith, Auntie P. You thought because you was my auntie, you thought because you was my auntie, you wasn't gonna get it. Nah, nah, nah. Okay, we don't fuck around over here. All right. <laughs> no, Argentina, Mori. I'm new. To <laughs> Ugly, bro. I told you not the answer, bro. You tripping? <laughs> Y'all thought I was playing, bro. Bam! Look, I told you. Look, P NTP got my bail money, but we in an iffy situation right now, so I don't know if I can use that. So I don't know. You might got me. <laughs> Bam! You might have got me, fam. <laughs> Stop playing with me. <laughs> Y'all crazy. Hey, for real, Cherry. They might steal that motherfucker. For real. <laughs> motherfucker sell that motherfucker. Goddamn, goddamn church folks then then sold your scooter. <laughs> goddamn, I, I caught the deacon pulling up on my scooter on Sunday. Matter of fact, it was yesterday. I caught the beacon pulling up on my scooter yesterday. I almost beat that nigga ass. I almost beat the suit off that nigga, all right? You hear me? I ain't talking about no wedding suit either. I ain't talking about no tuxedo, all right? <laughs> oh, news tubers, you already know. Ain't nothing changed. She working on it, though. She working on it though. <laughs> Shout out my nigga Bugs, man, for real though. Rose petals, what's good? Hey, society, I don't know what you still doing, but you were supposed to be in there that. You you wasting time. Look, you wasting time. You was wasting time, okay? You know shit just be fucking up left and right, left and right, all right? And we're going to keep blaming you, all right? So I'm just saying, do the right thing. Just, what would Jesus do? Just ask yourself. <laughs> Stronger me than ever. I'm telling y'all, you got them upgrades, all right? Got them motherfucking upgrades. Nigga, we, we went to Congress, nigga. We went to Congress ASAP, nigga. Said, nigga, we need to get this bill passed ASAP, nigga. This is a crisis. This is a crisis. But, uh, yeah, man, I'm finna, uh, I gotta leave out with a song or something for, for the occasion. Let me stop screen sharing for a second. Uh, where the fuck? Where the fuck? All right. Hey, but uh, besides uh, all the the bullshit you was talking. Yo, intro song, bro. That used to be my shit, nigga. That T.I., nigga. That used to be my shit, bro. Stop playing. That used to be my shit. You, I don't know how you you came on with that song and then just came with that 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 backwards shit. Oh, that pretty face. They ain't ready. They ain't ready. I ain't ready either. Shit. <laughs> I ain't ready either. Hey, I appreciate that, Myron. You already know, bro. You already know. Like I hey, Myron, like I said earlier, bro, I don't know if this nigga thought uh, I was world news from three months ago or however long ago that was, but <laughs> nah.
Today's students are busy. Learn where and when you want. Get started at devry.edu. Hey, hey, Mara, Mara, and I should play that door for him, huh? <laughs> I should play that door for him, huh? Say, don't play with me. <laughs> What'd he say? South Memphis, ho. Draco for niggas who try me. I buy a house, then started growing it. Little mama throwing it. I pull a phone on it. I'm going slow on it. Living for now, we live for the moment. She say when I touch it, she wet as an ocean. I crack the seal on some purple post. Play with the boss and get the motor. Fold the boss and get promoted. We just some hooligans. We just some savages who live in lavish. No, I'm not average. How you gonna win if you always stacking? How you gonna win if you always losing? He tried to rob me, I had to shoot him. Me see the army and stack. We just. Hey, answer that. How are you gonna win if you always lose? I might break up. All right. No, no disrespect, but I gotta play that Dolph. I'm just feeling it right now. I'm sorry. I gotta play it. <laughs> Damn, I ain't trying to play the video. Nope.
Dolph sending shots at you, bro. You making the city look bad, bro. Chill the fuck out. <laughs> And then I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna go over to the uh, to the draw shit. So if, if somebody could drop a uh, trail with draw uh, link in the chat, I probably I'm gonna be over there uh, after this last song. But uh, shout out to Dead Bull. You had dropped a video one time, and it was a song that I used to fuck with hard. You know what I'm saying? And that shit just rejogged my memory. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to you, Dead Bull, for that. I just put her name in the search. Dead. I was searching dead boy, y'all. <laughs> Shout out to Red Bull for making me remember uh them hits that my nigga DG Yola put out. You feel me? Shout out that nigga DG Yola for real. That song like the dude, you say motherfuck me, now nah, motherfuck you. I ain't gonna give up. No, I ain't gonna shut up. Get to. All right, Andy Starter. No, 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 no. <laughs> hey, society. <laughs> <laughs> all right one more song uh, one more song this 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 is a milwaukee song right here i just gotta play it real quick yeah, yeah. Yeah. 
why I shit you up. You know what I You sound good. Uh. Aye. Yeah. 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 You sound good. Sound good, nigga. Turn your line in your wives, nigga. Line in your lives, nigga. <laughs> line in your lives, nigga. <laughs> I just broke the school I'm Cap job found out he was fool. He probably had a wire on when we was in the stoop. <laughs> Y'all catch that? Did you catch that? Cap job found out he was fool. He probably had a wire on when we was in the stoop. Why we don't give a fuck in front of A, you can get it too. Got that big rooster. Sound like my bitch a booster. Do some top cruises. We start walking, you just lay here. Still a shoot your shit up. This ain't a lot. Make bad names from Milwaukee rappers. Bitch. I'm from Madison, Wisconsin, though. I dog pussy, dog food, and I sell dope. I can teach you how to come up. I know all the ropes. Yes, Sound good, but he don't feel that. Uh, that's why it's hard for me to feel that. Just like Joe, you should stay with your mama now. 50 up, yeah, it sound good. They ain't adding up. Goop stuff, yeah, it sound good. Why your goop is stuffed up? They ain't adding up. Last night, I was fucked up to that back end. I just tell her how it is, like I'm trying to make. I gotta take these rubber shoes and like Marlon Ryan. Put the put them out the way, then it's booty up with me. So I can tell my first to cook my dog when I finish. Won't go on a soft part. Gonna die like Jimmy. If he's can't stand the heat, then get the fuck out the kitchen. Money on my head, play mission. Better call it off for a working. You was not a boss. That's why you're falling off. I don't know what it costs. Yes, it sounds good, but he don't live that. That's why it's hard for me to fit that. Talking about a fall off, nigga, kill that. You should stay with your mama now. 50 up, yeah, it sound good. When I see you in the club, ain't that enough. Scoop stepping, yeah, it sound good. Ain't that enough. All right, that's my last song, y'all. I had to play my, uh, my uh my hood shit real quick you know what I'm saying nigga nigga get you in that mood sometimes you know what I'm saying but uh much love to y'all uh everybody still left in the chat K NTP Society uh I think Andy Stoner dipped out already Cherry probably dipped out but yeah much love y'all uh yeah we'll see uh if we have to do another one of these we shouldn't but uh much love y'all uh like i said i'm gonna be over uh draw shit in a minute catch y'all next time much love